And we're live. Hi, I'm Aussie Brick Chick and he's Aussie Brick Bloke. And tonight, what are we doing? We're finishing the corner garage. So we finished the first level. First two bags. And we've he's got a lot of building to do, haven't he? Yeah, but some of the bags there's not a lot to like bag number three, it's only these three. Yep, so he's going to need quick. some enthusiasm from you people. Uh, get him building, get him motivated, get him going, going, going. I want to say hi, yes, yay, Sean, cheerleaders, yes. As always, we've got friends hanging out in the background. We've got Ryan, who's uh, in Adelaide. What the heck? Right. Yeah, I just got Hello, bored, so on a plane. Excellent. Come keep his company good. We've also got Dark Side Bricks. Hello, everybody. You're building anything, Dark Side? I'm building a Ferrari, but not Ooh. one we've had before. Okay, excellent. Yeah, a Ferrari. Little, little baby one. A Just Ferrari a from, my, from my city. Yay. We also got Dan the Man from New Zealand. How's it going? We good. We good. Are you building anything tonight? Or are you just chilling? I'm gonna finish this thing. My lord, that is big. <clears throat> Not as big as that one over there. Anyone no, knows me, watches my streams, knows I hate technic. <laughs> I'm determined yeah. to finish it though. Ah. So for anyone who doesn't know, Dan is on Twitch. He's between the bricks. Go check him out. And last but not least, I've got Bilza. Hello. Hi, hello. Are you building or doing something tonight? I am. I'm building something super cool. Which I've been waiting ages for. Oh, hidden sides. Yeah. Nice. And, uh, I'm stoked to get, get that. Yeah, I had a, I had a brief look at these when I was over in Japan a couple of months back and been meaning to get stuck into them ever since. So as soon as I saw it on the shelf, I snapped it up. Exciting. All right, I'll say a quick hello to everyone who's joined us in the live chat. So far we've got Aussie Brick Chick. I don't know who that chick is. Johnny G says a treehouse free zone. Yes, we are tonight. But tonight, can't promise that next week will be the same. We've got an angry Bilzer, a Ryan Master, Ken Wheels, Michael Zaffol, Johnny Pieces, and Prawn Shack. Okay. And I guess uh, we'll see some more of the regular crowd shuffling. They might be expecting an 8 o'clock start. Sorry, surprise. We're early because somebody wanted to start early. But he promised me he's going to be finished tonight, aren't you? Or you're going to, you're going to finish yeah. training by yourself otherwise. Oh. Yeah, I'm guessing there's something else he's desperate to get started on. So, yeah, well, yeah. I wasn't expecting to be able to order it in for another couple more days. The man is motivated, boys and girls, to want to build the treehouse. And then all of a sudden it's like, ah, people, VIPs can order, order it as of today. I'm like, what? Jumped on that bandwagon. Two days later, it was on our doorstep. Nice. Awesome service. Mm. It's definitely much better than they could use the, the Sydney warehouse. Much faster. Well, as long as they've got stock available in the mm. Sydney warehouse. Always have take to wait. Long to get to Sorry? It would still take just as long to get to Perth. Oh, of course. Apparently, no, people have been getting it within a few days there. So, yeah, apparently it's been a lot better over there as well. There you go. Well, if you're in in the Sydney area, you basically get it the next day. Yeah. It's scary. Uh, Johnny G says, Treehouse would look sweet with the Ewoks. Actually, I've seen... People like say which uh, which should I build first, the Ewoks or the treehouse? And apparently, the Ewoks wins. Just buy eight of the eight of the treehouse set. <laughs> it's cheaper than the Ewok, Ewok Village. Yeah, it would be cheaper than probably the, uh, would be cheaper. Probably would be. Well, the Ewok Village was three hundred and fifty dollars, and each each. 
and that's only um two eighty. Mm. And it's a I can't believe the price of Lego these days. Yeah, welcome to the Australia tax. Yeah. No, they're just making a lot bigger sets and you know, obviously then the price goes up. Mm. Mm. Yeah, but we're still buying it, so no one's stopping. Yeah, 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 we've got the word sucker imprinted on our heads. Yeah. <clears throat> well, like that meme where Fry goes, take all my money. I wasn't overly too shocked with the price on this. I had a feeling it was going to be about the same as mine. <laughs> Well, especially after feeling how heavy the box is, like, I don't feel like it's overpriced. I don't like saying that out loud, but it's a, it's a very heavy, set. very sizable box. Because it's got so many leaves in it. It doesn't have that many leaves, and leaves are light. It is the set with the highest number of leaf elements. I wouldn't be surprised. Random piece of trivia for you. Oh, Ryan's full of trivia. And new colours as well. Yeah, the autumn colours are amazing. I saw the mm. game completed yesterday, I think yesterday. Um, and yeah, the colours on it are amazing. I saw I got the new. Um plant-based plastics in it too for all the leaves oh yeah you'll have to let us know how they taste uh -huh. how they taste <laughs> taste the rainbow that's well, only what uh five colors so yeah come on let's get distracted more building I'm just trying to find this stupid little one, little piece. What little piece? Like the, the... Okay, instead of putting your hand on top of it. Oh, like that. This. I did see it, and now I can't find it again. Yeah, well, you're looking at black on black. I'm not surprised. Oh. Um... Hang on, is that Sheree giving Sean building tips? <laughs> right, it's backwards verse. No, she's just being a second set of eyes. Um, there it is. Yeah. I helped. Get that sooner or later. Oh, hello, Blockhead UK. Look, there's a Ryan. No, that's not. <laughs> Oh, come on, he's your biggest fan. And he's like, don't look at me. I'm on Wi-Fi in a hotel. Yep. Just let me believe that no one can see me because everything I can see is pixelated. No. You look fine from our end. Yeah. yeah you look fine. Yeah, you look fine, fine from my end too, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> Careful now. Don't get him excited. He's very excitable. Okay. Johnny G says, what's Tubby building? You're not here when we started, Johnny G. We're building the box behind yes. me. Hello, Aussie Apple Galador fan. Michael's Apple. Were you here earlier or did I miss you? No, you must have been here earlier. Oh, hello, Andrew Thornton. The regular crowd's slowly shuffling in. I think we've confused them because the, the, um, the notification would have told them 8 o'clock. Oh, well. They'll, they'll get in here and we'll have warmed up properly by then. Yep. So, uh, live chat buddies, what you doing? Are you building? Are you sorting out stuff? Are you just hanging out and being bored like me? Oh, that, that gas pumped pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, cool. The octane sticker was a little bit sideways for a second. It's not a sticker. Oh, my God, it's not a sticker. It's printed. There are no stickers in this There's entire... There's no stickers in this entire not set. Not one. Oh, my Lord. That's rare. 
That is rare. Yeah. Not one sticker. Yay. God, I've got to look for another one of that same piece again. There it is. Make a squeegee. Oh. This might be an unpopular opinion, but does anybody actually enjoy putting Technic together? No. no. My didn't dad. Think, didn't think so. My dad. Yes, child. Like, ah. Seriously, I'm failing to see the attraction. Yeah. I think you get used to it. When you build more complicated stuff that actually do stuff, that's the attraction. Boring static models that don't do anything are really not that great, like technique wise. Well, we've got a Martin M's shoveled in. Hello, hello. Well, oh, there's quite a few people looking forward to that big car. Transport carrier thing? No, the big, no? the big digger. Oh, the digger thing. The big oh, one. Yeah. I can't think of anything that looks more boring. It's a big box with a shovel. Yep. Yep. Well, there's a lot of motors and stuff inside it. Yeah. It'll have a lot of functionality, but... Yeah. Well, most most big boxes do have a reasonable amount of functionality, and I do like a big box. <laughs> Before this goes where I know it's going, I'll be back shortly. It's not about the size of the box, it's how you use it. But, uh, yeah, one a, a big box with a digger on it, not really that much point is there. No. Oh, Blockhead UK yeah. says, spotted Steve in his roller coaster in a Beyond the Brick video the other day. Yeah, that would be our Steve. Yep. Keep telling him he's famous. He doesn't believe me. Hello, Steve. Hmm. That's good timing. He did just pop into the Yeah, he literally just popped into the chat. As we're talking about him. As we're talking about him. Are your ears burning, Steve? ABC hasn't stopped talking about you, Steve. Ah, oh, yes, yes. I've got the biggest crush on you, Steve. <clears throat> oh, just more really like how... Your famousness on, on, on Beyond the Brick. And, and how she has to hang out with the B-rated crowd because you're not here. <laughs> so, you know, those oh, of us to fill in B-rates. You don't be... You don't have your filler. You're all my A-string. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm... <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Uh, Johnny D says, regular crowd shuffling in, sing us a song, ABC. Oh, get me started. Just about bored enough to sing. He's taking too long. Ooh. Is this a new part or has that appeared in Friends and I've missed it? Oh, what, what is that? that? It's a heart. Yeah. yeah. Brick. That is dodgy. There's, what's that, buddy? Uh, the hidden side diner. No, that is straight up new part. Yeah, there's two of them. Cool. Wow. I knew I should have bought this set twice. What's wrong with just getting those two um, curved pieces and sticking them together like they do with the friend stuff? Yeah, you, you could, but having it in one plate is... Uh, Steve and Ryan, get a room. What's it used for in the set? I don't know. I haven't got that far yet. Um, oh, it's in the um, it's in the diner sign. They actually use it sideways. I'll show you when I get to it. But cool. wasn't wasn't expecting that. Yeah, they use it sideways. Probably saving on some plastic. Can you check the um, the anti stud nature of it as well? Will it stick to a plate on its own, or um, what's on the back of it? <clears throat> yeah, but even some of those nice new round plates won't stick to a base plate. So yes, but only on an angle. It won't. It won't stick. Like the heart should go, it sticks 
like that. It sticks on something, but it doesn't stick flat. Mm. Yeah, so it... Does it have something on the back of it? Um, no, it's an ordinary... Uh, oh, okay. It's just the the what, the way that the anti-studs are on the back. So if you had, like, a single stud attachment to it and then added yeah. to it, it would work. So it has to go like that. Yeah. Yeah. All righty. Oh, hello, Pat. Yeah, yeah, use a jumper for it. Yeah, or, or uh, just a one-by-one one round. Mm. Um, yes, um, that would um, also and work. And then you could angle it any way you wanted. Yep, exactly. Um, reading the live chat. Blockhead UK says, first ever technique built, I technique set I put together. The Mahasiv Bucket Wheel Excavator. Baptism of Fire. Ouch, my fingers hurt. Okay. Yeah, that's freaking huge. Huge. Yeah, I'm still failing to see the fun in that, but anyway. Uh, she also said, there's only one thing worse than putting technique together, and that's taking it apart. Or I would have putting agreed. it together taking and it apart. Apart. fun for it. Ryan, is your internet not stable? Uh, probably not. Is yeah, it disappeared in your camera. Sounds like something I'd do. <laughs> no such thing as stable motel internet, is there? <laughs> no. There's such thing as no motel internet. As seen in Gladstone. Isn't that right? Mm hmm. No internet. Perfect internet in Philip's room. No internet in my room. We should have gone over and streamed in Philip's room. That's right. Apparently you didn't have a door either, so it didn't matter, did it? <laughs> right. Who needs doors? At least there was a door to the outside. Mm -hmm. That is handy. Handy. Yeah, we shall not talk of the... um. Yes. That accommodation ever again. But it'll be on the internet forever. What are you talking about? Never happened to me. Never happened to you, huh? No. Oh, okay. Like that is it. Uh, Steve says, having to redo something on the build mistakes literally hurt with technical build. <clears throat> yes. Yes. Just don't make mistakes, Steve. Uh, yeah, don't make mistakes. Uh, Audra Hondi says, evening all. Evening to you. Evening. We are building the garage. We? We being he. I'm his cheerleader. Hurry up. <laughs> and <some> encouragement. <laughs> you can do it. I'm calling you Mrs. Buckford. Hurry up. Oh, my promises. Oh, my goodness. My little brother is in the house. Why are you on your shieldy one account and not your inside the brick box? And hi, Tassa Pen. Hi, Tassa. Hope you're looking after my state. <laughs> it's Ryanless. Yes. I know. It's going to apart without me. Oh, no. Uh, I found out Tassa Ped lives, yeah. lives like 10 minutes from me. Oh, does she just? Yep. There you go. Right. And, and, now, <laughs> and now you're in Adelaide. What's that say? Yeah. She's probably wondering how I know where I live, where she lives. I don't. Ooh. It's just the suburb. You know, I'm clever like that. Stalker. Oh. Yep. I know where you live too. <laughs> Not really. Who do you know? What, huh? Where do you know who lives? Tassipad. Everybody. Everybody. Oh, that's a secret. 
Well, let me know when you're out the front and I'll make sure the curtains are all open. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> That's the only time I'm out the front. So what's in Adelaide? Not, much. Not a lot. <laughs> Not that, but why are you in Adelaide? Oh, because I came over for Brixbow, but then realised I missed it by a week. Oh. <laughs> no, I, I'm here for work. Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, Steve doesn't matter. Should have stuck with the Bricks Bow story. It was funny. It, yeah, was. it was. Yeah. Yeah, that's why he went with the Bricks Bow story, and then people just ruined it. Although I am catching up with my Adelaide friends on Sunday. So Southern Bricks Bow. That's not the point. I was born in South Australia. Don't tell anyone. You mean your Adelaide's All the people is, is that it possible to legally change your birth certificate, place of birth? Uh, no. Sadly, yeah. no. That's not how it works. If anyone asked, I was born in Perth. <laughs> You'd rather Perth over Adelaide, really? Maybe. Uh, Blockhead UK says, got all the way through one big bag with the brick, what's it, the big wheel excavator. Realised I've forgotten a couple of gears buried deep inside the gearbox. Ooh. That hurts. That sucks. Ha! <laughs> Steve says, brave man dissing South Australia whilst there. Yep. Well, nobody knows what hotel I'm in on the eighth floor. It's still the murder capital of the world, though. I do feel bad because walking back from dinner, I saw no less than probably 12 homeless people. And that was in a probably 20 minute walk. That's shocking. Yeah. So, like Perth, you see the odd one here and there, but to see probably 12, 15 in you know, a 20 minute walk is kind of concerning. These these love heart bits are used sideways in a sign. Mm. That's pretty so they're good. not even used as love hearts. They're no. used as an echo type thing. Yeah, and then they've got um, pizza slice tiles that round it off. So it's kind of cool. I guess we'll be Which seeing could them probably probably new new sorts anyway. of coming up soon. Yeah, I imagine you'll get them in the the you know the turquoise and lavender colors before you know it yeah yeah they're going to be popping up in some friend sets too hey eh? you got to, you, uh, you'd imagine absolutely <clears throat> that's why i thought are they new or not because i don't buy a lot of friends yet, so i wasn't sure mm. but the um the dog is definitely new and it's um, it's a. Uh, it's like a little ghost dog or something, isn't it? It is. It's trans, clear, and white in the same oh. same elements. It's a little terrier. Yeah. Does right. it glow in the dark? I don't know. I think it does come to life in that. I haven't got that far yet. It's quite literally going to be a pro So, but the um the mini figs with their head gear and cell phones are awesome as well wow yeah i did get excited when i saw like all of the accessories and stuff yeah it's the main reason yeah, why cell phone they've had cell phones in some friend sets i think yeah they have and the uh, um cmf is it just me or are they um those on the shelf early uh yeah they're early. i believe they're early yeah because they were supposed to be first of August release, weren't they? Correct. Mm. Well, that's only like a day away. Two. Yeah, but they've been uh, over here. They've been on the shelf for like three or four days now. It's been right. days in July. Huh? Yeah, no, the day after tomorrow, a day away. I bought this this two days ago. I've just been waiting for tonight to open it, mm. which is not normally like me. I'm usually being patient. 
Jeez, Brian, is it cold or something? No, I just saw the um, hidden side guy in his hoodie and I thought, oh, yeah, I can wear my hoodie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really looking forward to getting that schoolhouse and removing all the hidden side stuff from it. Yeah, it's uh, that's what I was thinking too. A lot of people are excited over the train, and I can't really figure out why. I think it's a very ordinary train. Yeah, just, just I want to get the cheap train, the train probably. I liked it. I like the look of the train. I don't know the price point on the train, but you could be right. It could be a cheap way to make more bogeys. Oh, I've got enough bogey stuff to make about a hundred, but. It's the front ends and the different colours that I liked. Yeah. Mm. Good point. If it does not have a do not put out sticker, it's free game for the retailers to put out early. That is correct. I believe it's out overseas already, isn't it? Wasn't it just uh, 1st of August for us? Now, apparently that train has new wheels and a track bar. Okay. Maybe so that might be like why that. people are getting excited about it. Yeah, it must be. I think the new wheels, are, um, I haven't actually seen a good, I haven't had a good look at them, but they're all in-house mm -hmm. from what I understand. So they've gone away from, because um, Lego, uh, well, they third-partied the, uh, the steel axle was third-party, but I think wow. they're, they're entirely in-house now, I think. Apparently the bogey axles are plastic. Yeah, that's right. So they're all in-house. Mm, not sure how I feel about that, but I can understand why, perhaps. Uh, Order Humby has a question asking, what's the best and cheapest way to apply, acquire glazing in bulk? What do you mean by glazing? Oh, window pieces. You mean like glass pieces? <laughs> Glass, yeah, glass. Bricklink. Yeah, yeah brick 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 brick. <laughs> unless you can find yourself a Lego store with a pick a brick wall that actually has glass in it, does occasionally happen. Pretty sure Darkside got some What's some window sorry? pieces. You got some glass pieces on the pick a brick wall, didn't you? Um, yeah, yeah. It depends on what size you want to, obviously. Well, they had the the windows that open out um, like that. Oh, the shutters. No, the actual glass. Oh, glass window. Okay. The one by three by threes, aren't they? Are they one by four by threes? Yeah, something like that. Something like that. But they had those. They had the um, TransClear one by two by two panels. Okay. And they had... The big one by one by four by four, one by four by five, um, clear panel. There's some good scores on some clear stuff, man. Yeah, which I'm gonna make good use of too. All right, okay. Those are one by representation one by five by five clear panels i bought 400 of those from the pick a brick wall mm. and okay so so i would say if you're looking for things in specialized sizes and in bulk you're probably best to look on bricklink search for the piece itself and then um select highest quantity you'll find the stores that have the highest quantities in it and then just you know make your way down until you find a price that you're happy to look at Generally, how I go when I'm looking for bulk. Because if you go the other way, you mightn't find enough. It's all about using the search engine to your best ability. That's quite a neat little tree. Mm, that is a cool tree. Hmm. Hello. Can I style a tree? It's a bit clever. 
Yeah, it is a cool tree. It's like new green um, leafy prints that look like a dinosaur print. Mm. Which the instructions give you better eye, better angle on how the uh, leaves are supposed to go together. No, it looks about right. So it uses that um that piece that has like the bar, like the four bars coming from a round bit in the middle. And then was it use a is it a technic piece or is it a, a round brick? Okay. There's the destructions. There you go. And then you just place the the leaves on top of that. That's quite effective. Mm. My brother says, I hear the new wheels run much better than the old ones and are much cheaper to make this set with a test set. Well, there you go. It would be interesting to see how durable the parts are. Yeah. Uh, Blockhead UK says, got loads of those leaf pieces and lug bulk and pick a brick. Might have to make a few more for my city. I got a uh, Brickley order today and I ordered those uh, dinosaur leaf prints in orange and blue, I think. Cool. Uh, hang on, I grab them. They're on the other table. <laughs> Joe's garage by accident, we meet. <laughs> That's a cool motto. That is funny. I'm quite liking this front awning part of it too. It looks mm. really nice. Some good um, architectural things. I should be paying more attention to you. Yeah, dude, that's that's it in orange, if you can see that. Oh, wow. The dinosaur leaf and also in blue. Blue. Cool. I don't, that's I don't a nice packaging. I wonder where you bought that from. <laughs> I don't know why I bought them in those colours. I just saw them. I don't know, but they look very familiar, and I'm wondering whether or not it's the store that I think it is. Was it an Australian store or overseas? It was an Australian store. Is it perforated along the top? From Western Australia by any chance? It was. Does, does it have the perforated side? It does. How, how ah, good is the perforation it. now? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's like 20 That's questions right. to take me that when, many. When Sheree comes to Perth, I'm going to take her there so that she can buy something personally. Personally? Woo. Yep. Nice. So we're going to do a shout-out to the store because they're awesome. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. we've gotten Ali's Bricks and Bits before. Best packaging. Absolutely. Yeah. Very um, very good Brickling store. I've used it multiple times. Oh yeah, and then and he's really good. Paul Paul Daly, he's really good at um getting stuff out pretty quick too. He also helps out a lot at Bricktober. Mm. Doesn't very, always very exhibit, good. but helps out a lot. Mm. There you go. That's enough shout out. Yeah, I can't even remember. Was it stuff for your Minecraft? Yeah, I think it was. Yeah. It was one of those things where we needed certain colours and we needed them quickly and, yeah, we got them I think in time. I think it might be mushroom parts. Yeah, yeah, mushroom parts, yes. I ordered, some, I ordered some parts in the morning and then headed up to a Lego display and he messaged me when I was on my way there, so probably an hour later, saying my parts were ready to be picked up. Oh, wow. Yeah. And that wasn't just thrown in a box. That was all sealed and everything. With the perforation. Nice. That is nice. Happy day. Yeah. That is service. Definitely. I'm quite curious at how he actually does that. Well, I know like it'd be a heat sealer, but how yeah. to do the perforations. Oh. Uh, the, special cut of thing. Yeah, the the um, the heat sealer can have teeth in it as well. Mm. I used to have them at an old work site. Yeah. I've considered getting a, um, a heat sealer and being a little bit more careful when I open Lego sets and uh, just resealing them 
when I break them down and package them up again, just for the simple fact to stop it all getting thrown away. Yeah. Sell them brand new in box. Yeah, and keep it. Yeah, just chuck it back in the box and store it. Because you can't Sell recycle it. that packaging anymore. No, that's right. If you take it to a shopping centre, um, they've usually got soft plastic bins. Oh, they stopped all of those in New Zealand because we mm -hmm. don't have the ability to send it anywhere anymore. Oh, well, haven't stopped send that over here. The rest of the world send their rubbish here. <laughs> They're right. called immigrants. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Thought you were going to make a, a, a comment about New Zealand already sending enough rubbish over that way. I'm surprising that didn't come out actually. Mm. Oh, no, no, New Zealand sends all the good people over here. <laughs> I only say that because my mum's Kiwi. Yeah, that's how it works, right? Something like that. Uh, did I tell you I booked my flights for Brickvention? No. Just did. You just did. No. You, get, you finally took the plunge. Yeah. It's about time. I just had to drop my phone because as soon as you mentioned that, I had my phone in my hand and I'm, I'm like, I've got the money to do that. I chose to drop my phone. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll be bringing my boy with me, my 13 year old. Nice. Nice. I'm definitely going to try and come over then. Going to try. Yes, I'll, I'll, I'll do my best. Oh, I better not say that actually. Just thankful that Steve's not on the stream right now. <laughs> Bye. Oh, I'm sure he would make some sort of inappropriate comment. Ah, oh, Steve will say he'll make some room on the bed for you. <laughs> Something like that, but more Steve like. <laughs> is he still in the chat? Yeah, he is. Come on, Steve, say something inappropriate. We miss you. He's being terribly quiet. They're not guilty. Oh, did not say that, Ryan. I'm innocent. Yeah, yeah, you're really innocent. Come on, Steve, I'm waiting for my inappropriate comment. Don't let us down. Mm. So is there anyone in the chat from South Australia? <laughs> in other words, anyone willing to admit that? <laughs> yeah. uh, there might be one. Oh, listen to the Kiwi dissing everybody, man. Jeez, what's up with him tonight? <laughs> He's on fire. Wow. Obviously not reading the live chat. <laughs> I got it open. Can't be bothered. It's not that interesting. <coughs> I might just go down and see Steve for the weekend. Which weekend? It's only eight hours drive. I'm trying. I'm trying to incite some, uh, some oh, Michael, activity here. Michael's Affold is from from South Australia. Really? Yes. Sorry. <laughs> Are you apologising? <laughs> Are you dying, Sheree? Or I may have inhaled some water. <laughs> That's not very intelligent. For me. That's called drowning, you know. Yes, yes, it is. 
Oh, uh, Steve, your comments are like the timing is not right because there's like a 10 second delay and then you have to think about it and type it. <coughs> you really are dying. I am. <coughs> oh, dear. Please no more inhaling the water. Um, yeah, Ryan, you know how you said you were going down to, you could go down to see Steve? He said that's what she said. <laughs> hey Steve, we need you here. We can sit on the chat. You can come um, on screen. I'm pretty sure Michael is um one of the guys from either Sudden Sudden or um Adelaide Log. Which one? Why? Uh, probably both. Maybe. I might see him on the weekend. Maybe. You're in for a busy weekend. He's a this busy boy. I'm pretty much booked up Saturday and Sunday. No late night Friday streaming for you. Yeah, well, so what are the, other, what are the other three people in South Australia doing? <laughs> <laughs> All four of us are catching up. Uh, I knew proud Southern Bricks Love member. Yeah. I was. Are you going to the meet? And if so, I will see you there. Yes. This handsome face. Oh, I just remembered. You just remembered what? That was a squirrel moment. Oh, it's a car. Yeah, I do have Lego. I can build something. You've got Lego. I it's thought he just got Lego. It. It's a brick badge. Yeah. I thought he just remembered he had a mini bar. Remembered I had a what? Mini bar. No, they emptied it out. Oh, bastards. Which is good because then I've got room for my chalk milk. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Michael says, looking forward to meeting you, Ryan. You look after him, please. Good stuff. He'll get himself into trouble. I can just feel yeah, it. Oh, is that how you read that message? I read that message as, yes, I was going to the meeting, but not now. <laughs> oh. oh. Burn. Burn. Yeah. I'm just making the most of it because once, you know, Hangouts is gone, what's happening after that? I don't know. So, you know. Are you, are you calling me? Uh, um, uh, are you saying that I'm, I'm disorganised and not ready for it? No, I just said I don't know what's hanging after. I don't know what's ha happening after Hangouts. Something will have to happen. People's yeah. choice. You're the people's choice, Ryan. What people and were they intoxicated? Yep, that was for what? Yes, they were. That well, was I reckon it'll be, I reckon it'll be. You can still stream on. Oh my uh, God, you're in trouble now. Stop talking about Steve. Again. Uh, I'm I'm trying to I hear you, Steve. Keep into it. Here I thought we were going to have a half decent stream tonight. <laughs> it was half decent because I was Hello. here. Now the other half's here. There goes that. The Hoodie Brothers. Oh yeah, Steve, Steve and Ryan are next to each other. Ooh, ooh la la. I'm easy. I'm probably that side on your screen, aren't I? <laughs> huh. It's funny because he's just frozen on my screen, going. Dodgy internet. That's what she said. We've got to get out of South Australia. Can't be worse than mine. <coughs> it's funny. I complained about the Wi-Fi last night, and now it's working. So. Oh, funny oh, that. Funny that. There he is. Yeah. I don't well, know. I've been here for two weeks for work. 
Well, yeah. That was hilarious. Very, very boring two weeks. Yeah. Can't use the internet. Well, for work, I have business to do. I need Wi Fi. Mm. That reminds me, I'm supposed to be studying regulations and standards tonight. That's okay, you can multitask. I struggle to breathe and talk at the same time. Oh, you're my spirit animal. <coughs> I can't drink and breathe at the same time. Anyway, you're supposed to do those things at the same time. <laughs> Just seen uh, wooden play, um, twenty percent off. Uh, if you read online, Steve keeps breaking up. Are you breaking up with the Steve? I don't think so. Oh, you know what it is. I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> I thought it was just my internet. Like... No, no, he was breaking up. Adelaide even got the internet. Yeah, Adelaide got the internet. Oh, Hondi, I saw that before you retracted it. I was trying to work out if you retracted it or if he. She, he, they, hey, she. Worked it out. I forgot to take the cover off. Ah, cover off. The cover off his phone. Yes, we've had uh, this yeah. many times. The yeah. iPad, I know. It Shocking. covers the microphone. Ah, sorry, like, guys. I can't hear you. The, um, yeah. I was saying Build and Play Australia have got 20% off um, the new DC Comics um, Lego sets. That's the strangest thing that happened. What, what was the strangest thing that happened? There was a fish out there. Yeah. We saw the fish it was out getting... there and they were pulling over the guys for speeding. Oh, wow. That's exciting. No, it's not sad. That's sad. Okay, good it's on. It's sad, but exciting. Go watch your movie. Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> You'll need a, a light outside that says streaming. <laughs> uh, do, not, streaming. do not enter streaming. Do not enter. This is my safety zone. Go away, kids. Order on D says YouTube Just keeps censoring those, me. Um, I don't think so. Oh, get going. Bye. Thanks for dropping in. You need one of those on air dots out the front. Yeah, what were you saying? Big boo boo that Target did. What boo boo? Um, this is a Harry Potter set that's retails at seventy nine ninety nine at twenty nine ninety nine. Was that Target or Kmart? It's one of them. I can't remember who it was. Which set was that? One of the Harry Potters. So, um, the blue stage coach. Yeah. So the big thing they released the set um, about six months ago. About six months ago, they had a set that was about half the price of anyone else. Yeah. It was oh, it was the um, the Speed Champions set. Yeah. Not as it good as the be, um. Sixty-nine. Remember the Maya boo boo with Assembly Square? Yep. Ooh, that was a good deal. I've never been to so many Myers in one day. <laughs> we went to one, and then we told them about what happened, and said you might want to contact head office and tell them this is a national problem. I'm such a buzzkill. I went to four and didn't find a single one. Mind you, we said that after we bought ours. And it was for a good cause. It was for Kilo for yeah, a raffle. Yeah, for Kilo raffle one. We'd already yeah. bought ourselves one. 
one of the major retail chains over here listed everything on their site at 10%. 10%, like 10% of the actual cost. Yep. Oh my God. Yeah, I remember you telling me about this. And they decided during the day at some point that if you had screenshots, they'd honor it. Wow. <coughs> we got um, something like, uh, I remember paying $500 for my contribution to three trolley loads. Wow. Mm. Crazy stuff. It actually was crazy. Mm. The crazy part is that they were nice enough to honor it for you guys. Nice enough or stupid? Stupid would be my saying, but. <laughs> well, my question is. Call them A and B. Under, uh, under consumer law, would they have to honor it? No. Apparently, there's some loophole that they can get out of it. No, they didn't have to honor it. I think I think when it's less than cost price, I think they, there is a loophole somewhere. I was going to remember his New Zealand. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking about in Australia. No, yeah, the, if they the, make, it's not even a loophole. It's just straight up Blumen law. If they don't want to honour the price, they don't have to. It's straight to the They have the right to, to sell stuff at whatever they want. If they make a mistake, they make a mistake. But they chose to honour it across the country too. They would have lost tens of thousands of dollars. Yeah, wow. Yeah, crazy. So crazy. Yeah. And, Thanks, Paul. Uh, Thanks, Paul, now. The tow truck is such a cool little build. Mine goes, bring that to birth with you. He even has a... I don't know, without knowing that you're going to do it. I think a lot of people bought that set for the token. That is so cool. Yeah. Such a nice. I know. I say something about Ryan. He's not even paying attention. It's funny, Bill. The only reason I bought that set was I could stack the, stack the eBay coupon. Stack the eBay coupon. I think that's the only reason I bought the set. Yeah, wow. I was happy with that. Yeah, it's cute. Yeah. yeah, I was half expecting Ryan to say, just pack the, the tow truck in your luggage with you. Yeah, but you know what to do. I don't need to tell you. So I couldn't hear you over all the rustling. Could you be louder? Uh, yep. Yes, that is the corner garage set, Ken. It is very nice. You're up, oh, Miss Bit. You're obnoxiously loud when you're unbagging Lego. Uh -huh. Did you just boo who me? Yep. Uh no, don't touch me. Don't touch me. <laughs> don't. Hey, Bill. Yeah. I've got some cool tiles in uh, Bricklink Quarter today. Oh, yeah. Hey. Saw your uh, plate earlier. Yep. In pink. Yeah. I think they're in dark. Oh, no, they're just like light pink. Yeah. Yeah. I've got a heap of those in orange from the Chinese New Year Dragon. I didn't even know where they come from. I've just seen them in the store. Yeah. Add to, add to cart. Right. Yeah. And they only came oh, up. Who are you? you being shopping with? Uh, good question. I bet your packaging isn't all nicely sealed with perforations. <laughs> yeah, that one had the uh, those things as well. It was. Can I reveal the store? Yes. Uh, to be honest, Steve, whatever you just held up to the screen looked like you just held up a bag of crap, right? I couldn't see it. <laughs> oh, that's all right. It's. Uh, I think it's Craig's Eye Bricks. Oh. Really? Australian? Yeah, New South Wales. New South, okay. 
Yeah. Michael Daffel says the ASMR Lego string. Oh, I wish. That is way too close to the microphone. Ray Lim says, evening, all. Evening, Ray. The, the real reason I, I went to the store was for this guy. Ah. What's he out of? Fan Man. From uh, oh, yeah, Spider Man. Yeah. And the uh, the tiles will just add on, make make some sort of worthwhile um yeah for the for the shipping. Yeah, I always do that too. There's a, a message for you in the chat, Steve. Um, Blockhead UK says the tiny pink hearts come in the sister starship, among others, Steve Reynolds. Sister. Sister, you know the. Is it friends? It's friends. Okay, well, cool. No, actually, it's uh, Lego Movie 2. Lego Movie 2. Gotcha. Yep. LM2. Yeah, a sweet mayhem ship. Cool. Oh, there's a lot of pipes. Next step. Dr. Jones Animal Care. No snakes. That's what it says. No snakes. Yep. That's Jones. an Easter egg for um, Indiana Jones. Correct. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. I knew that Indiana, Indiana Jones didn't like snakes. I didn't know that was an Easter egg for it. Yeah, well, he is Dr. Jones. That's right. Oh, Dr. Jones. No time for love, Dr. Jones. Uh, the other done. purchase, trying to get the, uh, the the dice, the Lego dice with the tiles. Oh, yeah. Got two complete ones. And with the, uh, the Bricklink order today, I'll have another two. So I'll have four. But I want to get five because Yahtzee. Ah. It'd be cool to play Yahtzee with Lego. I think I've got I a few. Had, now. I had 20 of those dice. Oh, I've just, got just the actual um, dice part, not the numbers. Yeah. Just yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ryan's an overachiever. Yeah, I think I got them. Uh, I, I got a handful of them but from games I think and stuff. For about a dollar or two each. Yeah. Also, some uh, some weird heads, the uh, modified heads, bionicles and stuff like that. Which heads are they? Uh, the bionicle heads, the minifig heads. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I need a few different uh, different heads for something the boys are working on. Ah. I have to say hi to Ingrid Wynn. She says, "Good morning." Secret, I have a little time. Thank you for dropping by. We are finishing the corner garage. If you ever hurries up. We were so confident with the first bag. This bag is like, oh my God, there's so many parts. Um, I'm going to have to love you guys and leave you. Sorry to be only on for a little bit, but. Tap, tap. Yeah, yeah, she's she's uh, tapping. Out. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. I'll try and come back later, maybe. Better to have a little Steve than to have zero Steve. <laughs> There's no such thing as zero Steve. But there right. is such a thing as little. All right, I'm going. <laughs> Before I get in a lot of trouble. Hey, hey, you guys. Lovely but long time. Okay. Love you. Bye-bye. Bye. Night, Harry. <laughs> Good night, Harry. <laughs> you missed your heart, Ryan. Oh, well. uh, Ingrid spotted a Porsche. Yes, somebody is building a little Porsche. A little? Oh. Uh, there it is. And it's awful. 
Don't right. say that. I haven't built mine yet. Well, it's Technic. It's not that much fun. Oh. I don't particularly enjoy Technic at all. It's it's me and Technic are not friends. And yet you're still building it. What a trooper. Uh, I started it on my stream and it's, this is the only opportunity that I'll get to finish it. So <laughs> You're like, I started on my stream. I'm never finishing it on my stream. No. No, I won't get the chance to now. Mm. Ingrid says she has the Mustang. Mustang is nice. Yeah, that's a different story. That thing is a thing of beauty. Oh, yeah. I have that too. It's sitting up on the shelf just behind me, actually. Uh, down there. Yeah. Ryan, Steve saw your heart after all. He feels the love now. Yep. Yep. That Mustang's probably straight up one of the best creative vehicles that they've done so far, in my opinion. The Mustang, yeah. I'm impressed. It's a really, really good build. Especially if you got the ones that had the tiles that weren't all like, you know, really wonky, wonky. Oh, I don't think my tiles are super great. Uh, Aston Martin was pretty good as well. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right, actually. I didn't mind that. I'm, I'm looking forward to getting the Harley on Thursday. I've got a yeah. Harley coming, hopefully. I want to see pictures of it. I'm still going to get a Harley, but I'm not impressed with the pictures I'm seeing. Mm. That's a nice bird. There's not a lot of love for uh, technique. Uh, Aussie Brick Chick, have any of you folks figured out what to use for multi participant live streams after the end of July? Um, from what I've read, it's just going to no longer be an integrated part of YouTube, which has got to do with how Google Hangouts is changing. But um, Google Hangouts itself, like being able to hang out, is still going to work. So I'm hoping to perhaps use a screen grab of hangout because normal hangouts are not going away for um, regular consumers until later in the year perhaps even next year so hopefully they'll have rolled out whatever the new thing is before i have to think about it too hard but i do have I some think so. i think someone will make a patch pretty quickly to do it yeah I would have hoped that you two would have already sorted out something to replace it. And then phone is coming for a while. I don't I don't want to be that guy and, and tell you what you need to be doing, but I a friend, a friend. There's been a whole bunch of people that have been testing stuff this week over on Twitch and YouTube. Um, guys that you probably know, like Brick Smith and, yeah. and Brick Blaze and stuff. Yeah uh they're all going away to different things so oh they're, they're not going to stream on youtube anymore they are but i think they're going to use things like light stream and yeah i've been looking at live stream um i've been banging my head against brick wall trying to get things work properly because i think my problem is because this laptop has its own integrated webcam it makes oh, gives me dramas with the green room stuff so i don't know whether i'm doing something wrong i might have to pick your brain yet dan yeah no worries um 
And I think uh, Bricksmith sent me an invite to StreamYard to try <laughs> StreamYard out. Um, yeah, StreamYard is the other one that they've been trying. Yeah, so um, I am going to sort stuff out, but I probably will have to wait until the weekend. Um, but, yeah. Oh, look, if stuff happens and I can't stream with multiple people, then you'll just have to look at my face until I figure it out. How boring will that be? It'll be a lively chat. <laughs> Oh, my goodness. There was a pic going around Twitter with a big dinosaur from Jurassic Park gate set riding the Harley. It's hilariously perfect in scale. Uh, there's a, been a few of those. Is the, the Hulkbuster one, and Jane Bricks put Darth Vader on one. They all looked pretty good in scale, actually. Hmm. But yeah, getting getting back to the streaming thing, I, I had like I was testing out and trying out things on the weekend, but um yeah. It didn't work very well. It is a bit of a learning curve, but once you get there you'll be sweet. Yeah. I think if I was streaming on a desktop that didn't already have an integrated webcam like camera thing, it wouldn't be such a drama, but yeah. For some reason, it picks up the laptop and uses that for the green room. Instead, of, it, like, it doesn't let you choose what webcam you want to use for the green room. And um, having all sorts of problems with the um, audio on it. It was ri ridiculous. I don't know what I can you're probably better off um, downloading OBS Virtual Cam mm -hmm. and using that as your input. Because you can then bring everything across okay. using that one input. That's so Dark Side and myself are both using OBS Virtual Cam. Okay. That's why we can both worry about this in the past. Our entire production, sorry. I've told Sheree about all of this in the past. Oh, okay. I don't recall being told this specifically. <laughs> okay. Um but yeah, I, I I know what programs you guys have talked about being using, just not you know the webcam stuff. Well it was Dark Side that got me onto virtual cam. Okay. I was using OBS, but virtual cam OBS, you could only bring in one camera into Hangouts. Virtual Cam, we can bring in the entire setup. So that was all Dark Side's doing. So, what just happened? Is everyone else still there? Yeah, I'm here. Weird. Yeah, something just went all weird. Something just dropped. You just went all. Uh, Robotic. The robot, we call it. Everyone else is frozen. We're still getting feed through with everyone moving on YouTube. So I don't know what's going on. Glitch in the matrix. Do, do. Damn internet. Yeah. I suppose. I'll probably look at some things in the morning when I wake up. Um, here we go. Just a quick question from Ray Williams. When doing a mock of a house or some sort of two-story or more building, nothing fancy, should I use bricks like 2x2 two two and 2x4 two or is 1x2 and 1x4 fine? I need to place a big order of bricks, not sure what to use, just want to make sure it can support its own weight. Usually go one buys, but you need longer than one by four. Depends on the size of building. That's true. Well, all the modulars that Lego do are multi three and they're all one by. Yeah, that's true. 
I guess it depends on cost and color too. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's kind of like asking how long is a piece of string. <clears throat> I sometimes find getting the, the smaller bricks are more cost effective. Mm. Can be. Just as long as you interlock them. Should be all right. But I mean, look what's in this. This has got like one by sixes, one by fours, one by twos. Um, look, look at a list of what, what's in a modular. That'll give you a pretty good, a good idea. But again, it depends on the size of your building. If you're looking at something that's more like creator size, then maybe look at the sorts of pieces that are in a create, creator um, building. And you know, the smaller ones, not the expert size. Pretty sure, yeah. It's pretty standard to have like one by one, one by two, one by four, one by six. And depending on what you're building, sometimes you'll get one by eights or one by tens. But yeah, you definitely have to interlock stuff for stability, otherwise it'll just go. Unless falling apart is what you want, in which case do that. Hmm. It's all physics, really. And Blockhead UK says, are you wanting to do interiors? I would personally use one bias, as in one wide, not two. Yeah, I would recommend one bias, not two bias. Yeah. Um, for your width, because that gives you more space on the inside. Okay, something for filling the background of the Lego train. I would still go for one buys because I think they're more economical. Yeah, you'll get enough strength out of them as long as you're interlocking, right? And also, if you're going to make that kind of investment in stuff, you're probably best to go for one buys because it's what you're more likely to use in future. Um. I've only used two buys and things in the past because that's literally all that I had. And, yeah, it does make things really chunky. So hopefully we've given you enough of a, a bit of sort of direction. Food for thought. Food for thought. But, um, yeah, my advice would be to people who are completely clueless and it's their first time building something, that maybe look at, you know, the sets that are out currently and just see the sorts of pieces that they have in the sets. If you're not sure of how to go about that, um, you just need to really just look up the instructions. The instructions usually have the parts list in the back of the book. And you can find them on the Lego website. Oh, my God, I'm a fountain of information tonight. Mm -hmm. Anyone would think I was, like, you know, here for a reason. All right, your brother-in-law says, are you done yet? No. More for the point. Okay, this seems completely pointless sticking a white sticker onto a white panel. Is there anything on the white sticker? No. That does seem pointless. Yeah. Array said, perfect, thanks, was thinking one buys, but a mate said two buys, so just wanted your thoughts, yes. Your mate is wrong. <laughs> right, that, that's the only thing I have to say about that. Your mate is very wrong. Oh, yes, and Michael's Apple says, in the parts are on the side of boxes on bigger sets, so, yeah. Um, like, creator... The expert sets have them on the sides. I mean, other option is to just buy a set and modify it. That's how a lot of people start. I'd probably buy recommend a, a um, friend's set because they're slightly bigger. Yeah, it has good stuff. Ooh, One of the cool. bigger, bigger friend sets. The new piece. Yeah, it must be. So peak for the piece where that the um, yeah. 
It's like a it. cheese slope, but it's got the peak in the middle. Peak is on the middle and not the edge. Like it's uh and that came from um Nexo Nights. No, no, yeah. it's not the Nexo Nights peak, is it? No, I don't know. Pop up, pop. The next tonight's piece has like a peak in the middle, like a tick in the middle. It goes up on all yeah, sides. Yeah. Next like one's a pyramid. That one yeah, like a a piece. Piece. It first appeared in the pop up book. There you go. See, I know things. Yay. <laughs> Uh, Ingrid does make a good point. Ray, whatever you feel is right because it's yours, it's your own imagination. That is correct. But um, <coughs> at the end of the day, <laughs> if you're asking advice, I'll give it. You can take it and do whatever you like with it. Um, yeah, we've got people here that have been building for a fair while, I do believe, and some of us a bit more than others, but definitely got experience under our belts. Yo? My advice is experiment. Yes. You'll figure it out. Lego so can be the other thing you could do. True. You could also download LDD. Lego Digital yes. Designer. Not perfect, but a good concept. Personally, I think LDD is a waste of time. You're better off using Stud.io from Bricklink. Which is okay if your computer actually uses it. I, I prefer Studio as well, but up until about last week, it wouldn't work on my computer. Oh, really? Yeah, but in saying that, anyone else that's had issues with the um, opening, you can download it and then it just goes to a black screen. Anyone else that had those issues, try downloading it again because now mine worked. There you go. Uh, I've never had any issues with Studio, or whatever. Yeah, it was, it was some sort of issue that was recommend um requested to be fixed so many times by different people, and it looks like they've finally done it. Mm. Is that a hang up for certain um, Windows computers or something? Or yeah, it must be yeah, mm. some sort of incompatibility. Yeah, sounds like it. Uh, Ingrid says, I was doing a painting when a professional told me to change something and in the long run the painting got ruined and never finished. Yeah, the beauty of Lego is is that it can be changed really easily. So, yeah, I get what you're saying, but, you know, advice is advice and, you know, he asked for advice, we've given advice. Yeah, as far as using software, I guess it's just a personal preference. I agree. LDD is much easier to use, but Studio is much better program. There's a lot more that you can do in Studio. It doesn't help that I think officially... Um, no longer supported now, I think. No, hasn't been supported for ages. There's been no new parts in it for like two years or something. They came out saying that they were going to stop support, but then they did a backflip, but they haven't done any updates since. Yeah. So yeah. they said that they would continue to support it and then didn't. I wish they'd just make up their mind. Yeah. Well, I think they're so far behind studio now that they're kind of stuck. Yeah. And Lego are obviously happy to work with Bricklink, given the AFOL program, so... They're probably happy that somebody picked up that ball and ran with it because it saves them a job, doesn't it, really? Yeah. 
Yeah, I'd say in the next couple of years, they'll probably merge the two programs. Either that or LM, LDD will just drop away. Yeah. Probably. Uh, Ray says, appreciate the advice saying I'm new to building. That's why I thought I would see what you all thought. Well, that's what we're here for. We may not know everything, but I'll give it a good shot. I think we've got a good variety of builders in here. Uh, I only build friend stuff and technic. Friend stuff and technic. And helicopters and trucks. And winter village. And, 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 and. No, the winter village is 90% friend stuff. Yeah, good point. Friends is awesome when you remove the mini dolls <laughs> and the bright colours. And the bright colours. And, colors. and, and, and everything that makes it Friends. Yeah. You remove the Friends out of the friend sets and they're actually quite good. So I think potentially the only problem with getting hidden side is before release is I can't download the app. That sucks. Yeah, it just it gets to halfway and just stops. Yeah. Uh, no, no app for you. I'll have to wait two days to find out what all these cool zombie dudes do. No. But watch all the um, preview trailers. Oh, no, it's not a bad, bad set. I'm quite impressed. So do we get a tour? Or oh, is that the shrimp house thing? Yeah. Yeah, it's not bad. It's got a few little movements and and stuff that I don't quite know what they're for, but we'll figure it out once the app downloads eventually. I see it all turns the building into a monster. Yeah. Something cool, something different, some cool colours. I'm happy with it. It's a nice set. Yeah. And Ingrid agrees, not many people like the mini dolls. I like mini dolls. Give me all your mini dolls. I should get a PO box so that I can set up a fostering system for mini dolls that are unloved. <laughs> Bring an extra suitcase over for mine because you can have mine. The mini dolls creep yeah, now. want to keep all their hair. That's no fair. Yes, I'm going to shave them all and then send the full bodies over to you. I'm not going to let you have my address. Uh, I'll send it to you. <laughs> yeah. Bill goes, I know where you live. Actually, oh. I, I uh, bricklinked my first ever mini doll today. I've Why? Something I've never Why? thought of. Because I Are wanted Ariel. Oh, oh that's fair. Ariel. I wanted Ariel and she came in like a 40 or 50 dollar set and I didn't want her that bad and I got her on Bricklink and I got Flounder as well. Oh Flounder's for, cool. For quite um quite affordable. What about Sebastian? Uh no, but I figured that I could just use a little red crab. So oh, it's not Sebastian. <laughs> A side note, though, what do you think of the person they cast for um, Ariel in the live-action movie? Oh, God. Oh, I didn't know. Who had they cast? Um, it's, it's very controversial. Is it Zac Efron? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it's worse. Zac than Efron would be closer to Ariel. Oh, really? Well, it can't um, be worse than Dora the Explorer. Uh, yeah, it is. Uh, yeah. I'm that, that movie actually it without different. getting myself in trouble. Um, think of the, op the most opposite you can get from red hair and pale skin. Ah, oh, actually, I did read something about that. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh, there we go. Okay. Right. It's yeah, right. That's okay. It's it's not on my uh, two two C list anyway. 
In saying that, I did go and see The Lion King today. Yeah, what, what did you think, think of The Lion King? It was, uh, I, I really enjoyed it. I, it's some of the best CGI I've ever seen. Go, uh, and go watch it again. Okay. I watched it the first time and I was like, I was impressed with the CGI, how close it was to the movie. I watched it again and actually paid attention to it. And it just seems so forced, like they're trying to still carry on the jokes from the original. Yeah. But not in the same context. Yeah, right. Flat. So just, you know, enjoy what you think of it now. Don't go watch it again. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, that's okay, cool. I, 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 I enjoyed it. I thought it was well well done. I'm, I'm happy that they finally uh, said farted in the Akuna Matata song after all those years. Yeah. yeah. It was uh, – no, it was good. The kids enjoyed it. They probably should have gone to school, but they enjoyed it. Yeah. Well, they learned more from Lion King. Well, we, we only went and saw it after we – Got bored at SeaWorld. <laughs> something, something different for a Tuesday. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you. You know how we're planning on going to the Multicultural Festival? Yeah. We're going to have more people in the car. Yeah. I'm coming, Sean. <laughs> Are you not? No? Okay. No. What's more multicultural oh, than a genuine West Yes, it's yeah, not going to happen. Yes. Are they? Yes. Awesome. I must tell Jeff that. Oh, that's really cool. That's been like four weeks or something, isn't it? Yeah, 24th of August. Someone just got to pull a finger out and start mocking something. Yeah. Oh, we're just we're using our Canberra display as long as it makes it back in one piece. Oh, we don't have anything small at the moment. Mm. Just bring the corner garage. <laughs> I think that's a little bit too small. Bring, bring a few modulars. That's what we did the last time, and that was actually painful. Oh, that's right. I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> you were there, remember? Uh, I, it was a year ago. I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> a, few, a few years ago, for October, I decided to display my trucks. Thinking about 120, I think I had at the time. Boxing up and displaying 120 trucks was just a nightmare. Yeah, wow. The worst part was packing them all up again after the show. We're starting to contemplate moving house, and I don't know how we're going to move the Lego room. Have fun with that. Many days. Swing wrap. And many, many trips. I keep, look, I keep looking at sets now, and I'm like, yeah, I might just not build that one and just uh, throw it in the corner until after we move. So. Problem is, I don't know if it's going to be six weeks or six months, but it's going to happen. How many people run the Jeepway display usually? Uh, two four foot tables, I think. Oh, it's been a while since I've seen it. Not the point is I said do play stupid order correct. Duplo, Duplo is awesome. I bought some more Duplo today. Duplo addict. Yep. Best thing for building up under mountains.
Keep a second set of eyes on. No, uh, already. Yeah. A little gray piece. You got a gray bit on the end there. I need another one to come together on the floor. Which gray bit? The, uh. the one that's gray. Oh, shish. The one that's gray. The last one I can't yeah. see it. Here it is. Four little tables. Yeah, but how much space is four little tables? Four little tables. Yeah, to find a little table. I'll let make it eight foot. Yeah, eight foot by whatever the depth is of a little table. Oh, yeah, I think mum and dad said they didn't quite have enough tables. Oh, that's ugly. Yeah. This is a cool way of doing a little um, fish tank. Oh, yeah. Into the wall, isn't it? From memory, yeah, the fish is mounted to the wall. Yeah, hmm. really cool. That works. Yeah, I thought it was a little bit more, but that of I've got had a fish mounted to the wall, like as a trophy. Oh. Then I can continue building. I'm like, ah, oh, a... mounted upside down from memory. Upside down. Yeah, there's a fish. It's supposed to be upside down. Oh, no, it, is, it is the right way up. Oh, no, it, it is upside down in the instructions. Yeah, it's upside down in the instructions. I put mine the right way up. I was oh, a rebel. No, it's supposed to be a dad fishy? Yep. Maybe oh, that's what I'm to get. Travel Gaming says there's another set with that concept might be the pet store. Um, I've got it somewhere. I oh, probably can't get near it.
He's powering through it now. Well, the walls are easy. Swim, fish, swim. And no one pull. Uh, don't worry, I put the fish the right way up. Yeah, I did that too. I was a rebel. That's, that's really disappointing. Well, I guess he wouldn't be at the bed. Really shock over a dead fish. Oh, you kind of made it sort of slightly killing on the side. That's okay. Fish, swim, swim, fish, swim. I float upside down. Swim away from the light. Swim away from the light. Forty seconds lag. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you're in the chat. <laughs> okay, he says maybe they think Australia really is upside down. The fish is upside down to account for it. <laughs> that is a good theory. Oh, look, Ryan, it's got a frog. <laughs> frog just dropped off or whatever it was. Or it not? Or it I just tried. Seen it? <laughs> I've seen that before. Mm. Round cylinder with a peg on the top. Okay, a peg fix. A 40 second delay is because the live chat has a delay. It's on purpose. It's so that I can um, keep an eye on the live chat and, and, and censor things that are unsavory before people see them. He's at the point of streaming via 4G. Oh, so you're the person I'm going to talk to if the convention can't sort out our internet issues. You better be on 5G by then. Are you tapping out, Bill? Yeah, i got to go, guys. i got to go. Uh, okay, dude. We enjoy having you. Good to, good to be here to have fun with the rest of the garage and the porch and the hotel and the <laughs> whatever dark sides building. <laughs> that other car. That's right. And I'll, uh, I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks. Hey, Bill. No worries. Bye, guys. Bye, everyone in the car. Yeah. Ciao. Oh, I lost Brian. Ryan found the revolving door before Bill did. Come back. Don't wander into the light, Ryan. Little bunny. Oh, that's a cute little bunny. He's a baby bunny. We lost you to the revolving door, Ryan. Yeah. I'm back. I see Bills was going. Bye. Yeah. He had to get gone. He, he was leaving just as you just disappeared. Oh, it's my favorite American brother from another brick. Hey, big fella.
Oh, there's two Ryans now. Two Ryans for the price of one. And Nigel is talking. Uh, Adam says, mine have Telstra air close by to prevention. Yes. Well, now you know why I'm smiling at you sweetly and going very smiley. Yeah, because didn't Telstra Air just works off his normal internet? Yeah, I think it connects up with his home plane. Mmm. <coughs> it uses the same data yeah. allowance as his home internet plan. Oh, no. He's there, but he's not there. That'll be the first and last Technic set I think I ever built. He finished. Yay. Oh, this is painful. For a second, I thought you were just going to tap out and go, that's it, I'm done. I did that with the Mac Anthem. <laughs> Some people are not built for Technic. Uh, Primal Gaming asks, where in Melbourne is Prevention again? It is at the Royal Exhibition Centre. Um, in Carlton. Yeah, Carlton. The Royal Exhibition Building. Oh, right. Yeah, the I know what it meant. The, the Royal Exhibition in Carlton, right next door to Carlton Garden. Oh, it's unlimited Telstra Air for him. Plan, plan change my home plan soon. Ah, cool. I hope Telstra Air is good because I plan to use your Telstra Air. If Prevention, isn't, sure. if prevention isn't able to um, accommodate us, they're trying. When is it? Good question. If you ask my brother, he'll say, well, my birthday. Around the 18th of January. Uh, hang on. I will tell you specifically. January. Okay. So uh, convention day is the 17th. Public days are the 18th and 19th. I would suggest that if you're an AFOL and you're not exhibiting, it is well worth getting uh, a convention day ticket because it gets you entry to everything. So um, you buy a convention day ticket, you get um, public day um, entry as well included. Plus you get a goodie bag. Last I checked, um, that may have changed. But yes, it is definitely a uh, good time to go on convention day if you're an asshole. If you're not an asshole and you really love um, Lego, you may find it worth it anyway. And there's a good chance you'll see almost everyone from this panel there. Yeah. <laughs> almost. Ryan's like, soon. Take, taking donations for my flight. Well, the, the last time you're saying sh I should be mowing lawns to pay for your flight. Oh, he's frozen. Yes, the convention is is a great day. Um, they have like special guests, speakers, and stuff, and uh, workshops, and you can get around and see things without all the bajillions of crowds. Mm. It's great. Awesome! Why can't I see it? Oh, 
trying to read something. What does that mean? I have no idea. No idea. Hmm. Looks like looks like we've lost Brian to crappy motel internet. Ah. Oh. Disappointing. Ingrid's got to go. Bye. Have fun. Oi. Why do you keep putting it back up there? Well, because I need space oh, to okay. work on you other little things. Oh, okay. space to work on. Mm. It just makes sense to put it there. Nope, not hearing Ryan either. And dark gray. I think we lost him to the crappy motel Wi-Fi. Maybe I'm allowed to have Wi-Fi until what time is it? Yeah. Nine o'clock, nearly. <laughs> Almost some voice. Nine o'clock. You're only allowed Wi-Fi till Adelaide. Almost a voice. Almost a voice. <laughs> Somebody must have wet the phone line. Mm. Looks like it won't even let you do voice. Maybe you should try on your phone, Ryan. If you can hear us. I can hear you. We actually heard a reply that time. Mm. Shock horror. Oh, and you have an icon now. You had one before. That's why I said he was all blue. He's not a blue. If you look on the stream, he's actually got an icon now. You mean the blue guy? No, no. It is a um, Bricktober t-shirt, which makes the guy look like he has oh, a... On the actual feed, okay, on the actual screen, yeah. Sorry, I was looking at the Google screen. Yeah, the Google one is still yeah. blue there. Mm. But you look, actually look what's being broadcast. It's not blue. Not blue. Yeah, it's actually showing his feed. Mm. Was not looking at that screen. I just glanced down and went, oh, he's not blue anymore. If you're talking, Ryan, we can't hear you. That's the difficulty of talking to an icon, you don't know when they're talking. Mm. Oh, some curious typing. I'm using my phone hotspot. Oh my god. I think you missed earlier when I said this has a frog in it, Ryan. It's a frog. I missed the There's whole part about the tank. Oh my god, I oh, can yeah, actually see you guys now. The fish is upside down in the tank. In the instructions. Yeah. We were distressed and we couldn't do that. But there's a froggy so the frog? and a bunny in the um in the yeah. veterinarians. There's a little froggy in there. Oh hang on. Helps if I click on it, hey. Down in. There. In the little uh -huh. it's like a little Ooh. Down in there. Aquarium -y thing. There's two of you again. Yeah, I know. Not anymore. Not again. It's actually strange being able to see things now. <laughs> yeah, I was I've saying. Gone whole, I've gone the whole stream just seeing pixelated shapes. Oh.
Uh, Primal Gaming. Thanks, Primal Gaming. See ya. See ya. Yeah, that modular will probably be the one that convinces me to start modulars. Well, because it has frog in it. Oh, more the tow truck, but yeah, the frog. <laughs> Little detail builds now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All those sand blue bits on the desk there, are they going to be part of the roof or something? Uh, I think the front is uh, up in here. Oh, are you still only up to the second floor? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I be almost finished by now. Oh, look over there, and there's so many more bags yet to go. Yeah. And how much is that set? 200 and something. Tempting. Uh, your brother in law is dissing you and saying, Is this a three part stream? No. He's going to make me stay awake until he's finished. I'm fine, we'll just finish at the end of this bag then. Alternatively, you can just send it to Perth and I'll build it and keep it. Postage to Bundaberg again. would be cheaper. You'll never see it again. Yeah, but that doesn't help me get the set. No, I know that. <laughs> Going anywhere outside of the house. Oh, is that so? Yep. Them fighting words. Yep. Your brother in law says, just give it to me. Well, no. not likely. Not likely, low. <laughs> no thanks. How, how about you hurry up and pay for your brick venture? Lacquer. Has anyone heard of Brick 124? No. Where is it based? Um, yeah, oh, what comes um, after Brick 123? Brick 124 <laughs> would like to introduce to you our minifigure range. To see Brick 124 figures working with construction bricks, visit blah, blah, blah. Oh. Lucas? They are little dolls, like miniature Barbie dolls. Oh my God. Sort of the size of like to fit into minifigure stuff. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry, hang on. I'm just feeling a little bit sick. Why? I have no idea. Why? All I can say is give up now because no Lego person in their right mind is ever going to buy them. No. Well, they've shared it on the Lego Mox Worldwide page. I'm surprised it's still there. Yeah. Mind you, that group's not particularly well moderated, so, you know. No. They're kind of like little miniature Galador um, people. Well, they were. Sounds like a scam to me. Well, they are revolting. Hello to Brick 25. God damn it. Yeah, I, I'm not seeing any photos of actual products on their website. They're all just digital images. Mm -hmm. 
Quit while you're ahead. Quit while mm. you're still ahead. I won't be buying any. I have one word for that. <gasps> I know. I wouldn't oh, take them if they were free. With all sorts of accessories. That's just gross. You're just showing this to G as up. It's disturbing, that's what it is. It's extremely disturbing. You'd think they would have at least changed the head so that you can use Lego hair. Mm. They've got different hairstyles. But yeah, they should have just changed the head slightly so that you can use actual Lego hair. That's uh, just wrong. Um, or they can just keep it away from the product altogether. Uh -huh. If you could use Lego hair, would you buy it? No. Uh -huh. That makes no odds. Mini figs are the best part of Lego. Why would you buy Lego if you want realistic? I do agree, but there must be a minority of people who enjoy those more realistic figs, even if I'm sure that those people would enjoy more traditional modelling than Lego brick-based ones for their build. Okay, change of topic. Rick 25 says, it was my birthday yesterday and I got the Saturn B. It is huge. Yes, yes it is. That's what she said. I was waiting for that. What are you quietly packing away there, Philip? In order. Oh, Gee, we're still, still going. Yeah. You guys are still on. Yeah. No, no, sorry. Yeah. I just of your imagination. I thought I'd be getting into an after show or something. <laughs> Damn it. He's like, Pretty now I have to talk to people. <laughs> but Ryan's still here. Yeah, he's got another better to do. Yeah. <laughs> Got this whole hotel room to explore. To do nothing with nobody with. In all fairness, though, you have to question Ryan's. Uh, yeah, you got to question his. Um, shit, I've lost the word. Forget There's it. a lot of things about me that need questioning. Back <sighs> around and come back. Sanity. Question my sanity. Question my motives. <laughs> There's a lot of yeah, I have no idea what I was going to say. Question: What, why, why he's here? Uh, because Steve was going to come. No, I was going to say because he keeps coming and going. So you know, he hasn't even stayed the whole time. You know, I I just left because Steve wasn't here, and then I thought I'd come back because I thought he might have come back. And you yeah, know. exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is actually going to somebody that you know, Dan. Great. If I guess, will you tell me? Over in the yes. mother country. No, no, not on a live stream, I won't. If, can I guess the city? Um, yeah, you can. Wanganui. No. Oh. Okay, well, that killed that bit of suspense. Yep, sure did. <laughs> How's the garage going, Sean? Slowly. Yeah. He's nice. He it's a little bit past the first floor. Is it going to Sydney? Sorry? Is it going to Sydney? It's going to your country. Oh. <laughs> In unrelated news, anyone that enjoys um, seeing the tips and tips and bricks technique posts, which are really good. Yep. 
Uh, West Coast Lego Users Group, which is a really good lug in WA, just saying, um, are actually starting to share them from the very first tip because you always see the latest tips shared on just about every Lego page. So if you want to see them back in the very start, their first post was about the height of Lego bricks. Just the tip. Just the tip. Just the tip. <laughs> so yeah, if you want to see stuff that they haven't posted for over two years, then yeah, like the West Coast Lug page. That's not a shameless plug. Little, little bit of shameless plugging there. No, shameless plugging would say it is the West Coast Lego Users Group. Look us up on Facebook. <laughs> I'll personally accept your application. Yeah, I'll take everybody. But yeah, it's good to see something other than the same thing that every page shares. Which is what? The, well, like, the is, is. latest the tips and tricks thing. Sorry, what was that, Mr. Robot? Mr. Robot. Is my interweb <laughs> playing up again? Yeah. What's Just what the, the post from the tips and tricks. The Facebook page. Yeah. And what time do you call this going to bed, young man? Slightly late. Slightly late. <clears throat> By our clock's just seven minutes late. That's more than slightly late. Um, it could be zero minutes. I would believe the parenting of teenager. It's nice to feel wanted. Hi, Steve. There's uh in the Brick Gambia um page. Yeah. Woo Brick Gambia, woo! Sorry. I um I applied to display I, I can't make it in person, so my buddy Marcel's gonna take it over for me. But there's um a friend of mine, Steve Reddy's posted 23 times, we want Steve. Well, I'm catching up with him this weekend, so I'll let him know how bad you actually are. Give him a hug for oh, no, he, oh, he. I've known Steve for a while. It's all good. You, you want me to hug everyone. Why don't you just move here? What, to Adelaide? Yeah. Hang on. I know the answer to that. I've, you don't I've, need got, I've got friends there. I don't want to tell the truth. <laughs> 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 yes, I am in Adelaide at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's only an eight-hour drive. I'm up for the weekend. Only, only eight hours. Yeah, Ryan has a motel room and it's very empty. Yeah, I've got a hotel room. to get back as well. I've got a hotel room. Okay. He's got a whole size bed ready for you. The problem is you've got to be in Adelaide. Yeah, that is a drawback. <laughs> A destination, you need eight hours. It's eight hours of painful driving to get to Adelaide. Of all yeah, places. Think how good you feel when you get out of Victoria. Hi, Kaz, if you're out there. <laughs> <laughs> and Nick. <laughs> oh, but Brian's worth it, Steve. Yeah, I'm worth it. I yeah, that. nah, I've got, uh, I'll be washing my hair that day. <laughs> yeah, that, that's understandable. Yeah. Sorry, Ryan. <laughs> that's all right. I'm still trying to get down to Brick Mansion. Yeah, no, dude, you got to come down. It's just yeah. the realizing that it's in Melbourne that I'm struggling with. <laughs> it's it's like another planet to WA. Yeah, we have shops I open past seven thirty. Where is long? I have that. I think. Who has what? Shops, but open past seven thirty. WA has nothing. Oh, last week we invented the wheel. <laughs> well, they've got nothing now that you left. You got what? They've got nothing now that you left. That's right. Oh. Tearing up a bit. Anyway, back on the topic of Brick Gambia, because I was actually born in Mount Gambia, just saying. Um, when is it? 
still a good question. Uh, I had that on there before. Um, I know applications were the 4th of August, so it shouldn't be too much long after that. Isn't it in September? Yeah. Um, yeah. Usually it's it's around grand final week or that hot. weekend. So that's what sort of kept me away from it in the past because my wife's a Richmond supporter and likes to go to those things. Has hmm. so her team ever been in it? Her team, yeah. Yeah, they won it a couple of years ago, so uh, where is it? Oh, that's right, yeah, because my boss put the um, flag up at work because he's a Richmond supporter. And then the next year the Eagles won and no one had the balls to take his flag down. Okay, 6th and Monday, 7th of October. So it's actually on Sunday and Monday, the 6th and 7th of October. So that's uh, an awkward time. Um, oh, that's perfect timing for me. Yeah, it's it's, an, it's good if um, yeah if the if the AFL was the reason, but you just never know what could be on in October. So it might be busy. October, October is. Yeah, this is October is the next weekend. Mm. Yeah, you'll have a house guest that weekend. Doesn't mean I have to be there. <laughs> yeah, I'm leave trees trees a bit of trees. Oh. Better idea, Sheree. Meet me in Mount Gambia. <laughs> you and meet me there. Back. And back. Drive back. <laughs> no, I've done that enough times. Uh, can yeah. we all ask question? How do you sign up for the convention? If you're an exhibitor, you need to hurry up. There is an air table um, form. Um, in any of the lugs because it's been posted in just about every other lug there is. I haven't seen my cat Matt. Lug. Yes. Um, if you're looking to sign up as a volunteer, volunteer um, applications haven't opened yet, they'll open up later in the year. But yes, applications for exhibitors are about to close. Oh, Ken, you're not in any lugs. Okay, Ken, where are you from? Which mm -hmm. state? New I South thought you were in Sidluck. Hmm? I thought he was in Sidluck. Yeah, I thought he's New South Wales. That doesn't necessarily he's automatically in Sidluck. Yeah. No, he, I'm sure he told me on one of my streams that he was in Sidluck. He lied. Maybe he used to be in Sidluck. He's in New South Wales. Uh, he's in New South Wales. No. Um, hang on, mate. I'll see if I can find the link for you and I'll drop it in the live chat. Sorry. My bad. Who's making noise? Not me. All right, my camera's, my internet's not dropping out. I just, yeah. Has it been posted in Oslo? Uh, probably. Would you be able to find it there? Probably not. It would depend on whether it was deleted, wouldn't it? Yeah, exactly. Well, and also, Oslag sees so much traffic, you probably wouldn't find it anywhere. way to find this. Wake up. Yeah. Um, uh. Not to do Sidlug, but they are very, very slow to add members to their group. They're very picky. I've just dropped an Airtable link. So um, if you follow that, that is the application form. 
Okay, so application process this year, basically they're going to have like two rounds of applications. So the first application will ask you the most basic information and they will filter people based on, you know, whether they've been exhibited before, whether, you know, uh, they're known, et cetera, et cetera. If somebody new, they might ask you for some photos to follow up. Um, I know some people have already sort of been with the whisper and told they're accepted. Um, and then there'll be a second form coming out that will have, you know, wanting more details and stuff. So there's a lot of people that have applied this year. That is from the horse's mouth. So you better have something good is all I can say. I thought all you had to do was just tell them how much space you need. No, not this year, Steve, but you might be a special. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Oh, that's... We could just do what I did and just tell them I don't know what it's going to be. It'll be Lego yeah. and see yeah. how you get on. Yeah, we, we heard what your application sounded like on Friday day. <laughs> I offered to share a table with one of the committee members, but I think I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> I'll only need like a third of a table. Mine won't be big. Mm. If, if anything. Well, I, I suggest Ken Wheels that if um, Sidlug won't have you, just you just join the QLUG um, Facebook page. We do disseminate a lot of information there and we take anybody. Hit, hit up Kevin Evans on Rainbow Bricks as well. Uh, yeah, they're a bit picky about who they have as well. Hey, Steve what, what, sent you. Can, can I ask why are lugs picky about who they have in their in their lug? That's a little I, bit. Um... There's just been a bit of drama in Australian lugs lately that some of them are a little bit picky about. Like they're they're basically betting a lot more heavily. Um, also, to be fair, I do believe Sid Lug had like a show on the weekend or they have a show coming up very soon, so they may just be snowed under with like stuff for that. But I have heard people say that they've had issues trying to join Sid Lug. I don't know how to expedite your process. I'm sorry. But like I said, kill luck, kill luck. We'll take anybody from <coughs> anywhere, won't we? Yeah. Well, they've got Cherie, right? So. <laughs> really low standards. No standards. I remember. Yeah, do you think West Coast Club will have me? I, I can be an honorary Ooh. member. Are you a member of West Coast Log? Uh, Did you fill in the application? No. I'm yeah, have, the application. Have with the Bricktober application. Start now, you'll be finished by next week. <laughs> We need to have a few breaks in between. I had to fill out the application for Bricktober. It signed out on me twice. I had That's your Queensland words. internet. I had stern words with somebody, and it weren't Ryan. That's because Ryan handballed you and said, don't talk to me about it. <laughs> there was nothing wrong with the form that I created. Hmm. Uh, Ken says I'm in well lug as an out of town person. Yeah, oh, you can be in Q lug. We don't care that you live south of the border. We'll have you. You're in what lug as an out of towner? I've been to a Q lug event this year. Isn't that enough? Hey, you're allowed to be in Q lug. Why would you want to be there? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to join Brisbane because I've heard they're better. Oh, you did not say that. He said it. He said Someone that. Said it. Someone said it. I didn't say it. I'll forgive you for saying the B word, but I won't forgive you for saying that they're better. I've been to a Brizlug event. I mean, Briz Bricks event. A Brizlug. Whatever it is. It, it was a Q-Lug slash Brisbricks event. Thank exactly you. Exactly. I've, I've been to a Brisbricks event. You've been to a Q-Lug slash Brisbricks event. Actually, it's a great joke. World event, but, you know, <laughs> who's splitting hairs? You're a star, Ryan. Yes, yes, I am. It's getting that time of night. You know, it's late here. 
<laughs> You're behind us. What are you talking about? Yeah, but I'm not on WA time. Oh, just wait a while. You'll be right. Yeah. I think um, I can probably say something here and get home to WA before it actually gets on the internet over there. Uh, I'm looking at all this Lego he's dumped out and I'm looking at the time going, you're not going to be finished. You up to the third floor? Do it, do it. You can do it. Turtle power. Finish. Uh, Ken says he's been to a Rizbrix events also. I've been to heaps of Rizbrix events. Like, I'm just stirring, okay? Brian's just a shit stirrer. Not me. Speaking of shit stirring, uh, on my... Uh, oh, we don't want that story. No. This is a very, very worrisome segue. I yeah. didn't say... I, I, didn't say good I said stirring, not smearing. No, it's a tame oh. one. Um, today I posted something in uh, one of my in my Facebook group, the DC Marvel Australia fans, um, about Endgame available on iTunes, um, and that I was downloading it. And somebody says, and this has got to do with Lego. How? <gasps> I'm like the creator of this group, and you question my posting. Blah 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 blah. It's a fair call though. Um, but yeah, you're missing. Uh, I was about to call you Richie, but I oh, take. No, no, no. Take my oh, no, I actually made a made That's a point of letting them know that it was a fair fair comment, but um, we can actually pause it and, and see certain scenes of buildings and things. So those of us that are mocking um, sections of the of the movie, um, it's handy that we can actually see things like rooftops and the oh. way some of the buildings are. But yeah, it was one of those where, um, come on, I have like the biggest band hammer here, and you're questioning me. <laughs> oh wow! Don't don't let that uh, control go to your head or anything, bro. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. What? Someone just someone just commented on the, the thing, and yeah, so it, it made me remember that that happened today. Um, yeah. Uh, I just all, down the, the, all the powers. Yes, C completely unrelated segue. Um, if yeah, like the stream, like the stream. There's a little thumbs up button. It's awesome if you press it. Don't already subscribe. Hit that subscription button because um, yeah, I like to hang out with you on a regular. Okay. Cat Matt just says Steve. I read that Steve. I started filling out the, the brick printout form, but I gave up. What? No, you did. It, asked, it asked like four questions and then says submit. How no, wasn't that? Yeah, no, we we're not this fussy. Although, although Peebles doesn't allow Micropolis, so you know that, that outs me. I might take some anyway. Well, en enter your miniature village, your miniature city. City village to a scale that shall remain nameless. Yes. To Lego architecture scale. Mm -hmm. Bigger than architecture scale, though. Oh, there you go. It's bigger than Lego architecture scale. Now. Are we there yet? I got my Lego Ideas Treehouse today. Your Lego what, what? I got my Lego Ideas Treehouse today. You did? I'm just seeing if he'll actually react, but he's not. He's that focused on building. I thought you were talking to her. I was just saying it as a general comment. I thought your ears would prick up when you heard Treehouse. The last time I heard you talk about the free house, you said that it was a waste of money and it's just a it tree. <laughs> it is, and I'm not getting it. If it had been a Christmas tree house, that would be different. Well, turn it into a Christmas tree house. No, I'm just going to drop $400 on that um, exclusive but not really exclusive Christmas set. What? So the employees exclusive. only but sent to every second person in the world set. The reindeer. Hey. It's a bit more exclusive than what you think. You don't waste four hundred dollars on that. Okay, I'll just steal yours. 
<laughs> Did you get one? Uh, I didn't get one. Our ambassador got one and because he's not a Christmas person and I actually do an awful lot of work for our love. She stole it. Because I'm, I'm the two I see. Did you say but awful lot or just a lot of awful work? Pretty much all the work, but anyway. <laughs> awful we work, I think she said. <laughs> awful work, yeah. A lot of awful work. He gave it to me and he said, make sure you stream it, so I did. Nice. Yeah, I'm so not only did I get it, I also devalued it and built it. I built mine. Why would you get it and not build it? I don't understand that. I don't know. People are weird. Uh, um, set was that again? Of them on eBay. Which Christmas set was that? It was uh, last year's Star Half exclusive. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, if anyone doesn't know what I'm talking about, just go back through my live stream, build things. I built it and then he came and rescued me. Because I built it wrong. Uh, Blockhead UK says, why are they sniffly about Minecropolis Aussie Brick Chick? Oh, they're not sniffly about it. People just doesn't like it. <laughs> He's like, I'm tired of the Minecropolis. What piece? The angle plate. The right angle plate. What right angle plate? It'll fit perfectly in that space there. Oh. What colour is it? Dark plate. You sure it's dark blay and not a different colour? Yes. Dark blay. Gets in with the rest of the dark blay. What's in it? Oh, there's that. Don't mind that. Sometimes you've got to stand up. Um, it's not underneath the book. No, no, sometimes it slips. Underneath the book. You probably haven't put it in the wrong place somewhere. Oh, do you see it anywhere else? Just asking a question. I feel that's a piece of stone. Oh, okay. It's not a bag. All right, Steve, I think I'm sharing the screen. Can you see that? Oh, I can see that. Very horny, that reindeer. It is. Yeah, right those ones are pretty big. Cool. Yep, that's the set. It, it's quite a large set. <clears throat> yeah. Are they custom? Are they custom? Um, or they are they only unique to that set, those color, color pieces that for the yeah. antlers? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. The small antlers, the small sections aren't because I've got them. Yeah. I think it's the um the middle tail section or whatever it's called that's exclusive. Could always do and it the, brown the, anyway. The printed um brown brick for Santa's face. Yeah. Oh, which okay. is two eyes, isn't it? Two texture dots. <laughs> yeah. But you could always do the antlers in brown anyway. Yeah. Yeah, that looks cool in December. <laughs> it looks cool right now. Look at, look at the box that it came in. Get it out of the cupboard. Yep, go get it, Shree. If I can get out from here. Like 20 bajillion. For anyone who hasn't watched me build it. Get out of here. Um, did, did you talk about Blockhead UK's um, question about the Micropolis? I might have missed it. Yes. I thought you might have. Yeah, sure, he answered that. It's all right. Someone's paying attention. Mm. I think it's more about the. Um, not so much as individually sort of exhibiting. I think it's more a collaborative. I don't think that they like the idea of a collaborative build for Micropolis. But uh, is there's... there a reason they don't want exhibitors just bringing a collaborative build? Yeah. And I think they're after height and a lot more sort of um, um, grab your attention sort of thing with the displays. 
and Micropolis, Micropolis, um, yeah, just doesn't do that as a rule. Well, unless you're crazy like me and have a whole city full. But anyway, mm. um, Dick Ryan. I mean, they did the micro, the <laughs> Micropolis scale of of Melbourne last year. I'm oh, sorry, earlier this year, uh, someone did that and it was wonderful. So they're definitely not against Micropolis. I think it's more the collaborative side of, of Micropolis. No, it's just he doesn't want somebody bringing like a... a mm. Which is happening past. Mm. Right. She's showing you her box. I'm showing you my box. Look, look at those flaps. That has flaps on it. It's an opened one as well. You've built that set, haven't you? Yes, yes, it's been defiled. Notice how it's wrapped up like a present. That means you're supposed to give it to somebody. <laughs> yes, it was given to me. Oh, no, you can't show the exclusive minifigures that are printed on the back of that box. No, I can't because I just opened it. Why not? It, it comes with exclusive minifigures. Yeah. That is so cool. Why can't you show them? Because they're exclusive. Ah, oh, bollocks. They're just reprints. They're being a smart ass. Yeah, they are reprints. Okay, so we got reindeer. Look how big that is compared to my hand. It's huge. It's massive. It's very big. Actually what? works perfectly as an oversized horse, which is what it was modelled off. It was modelled over off uh, uh, an oversized horse. It does just look like a horse, doesn't it? Yeah, it's a horse. Now, now you say that. Does it have a set number? Um, it is one zero nine nine. No, on. that's the number of pieces. Oh, hang on, no. Um, four zero zero two zero one eight. So four zero two zero one. Eight. No, four zero zero twenty eighteen. You're looking on eBay, aren't you? We've got Santa. Cool. Well, how much are they worth? I think last time I checked, they go for about 400. 400, is that all? Hmm. Yeah, I was going to buy one at 300 and didn't. Santa sleigh. And there's these little boxes. And each box has a minifigure in it. So you got like the pirate, classic pirate. Got the classic medic. Cool. And who's this guy? The uh, Blacktron? Yeah, probably Blacktron, maybe. Yeah, Blacktron one, I think. Yep. Yeah. Uh, 446 is the cheapest on eBay. And it comes with this little freight thing. Goes on the back there, like so. No instructions on brick set. There was someone know. talking about reverse engineering it. There are looks like there are instructions on um, on YouTube. Yep. So like the gifts are supposed to go on the back and. The tree is supposed to go somehow. There's, there's instructions sitting on Sean's build table. <laughs> that. Get in there, tree. Tree, can you just flick through the instructions so that we can pause it frame by frame? <laughs> really? There's no, like not three really. Books. No, four books. You really want me to do that? If you want a set of instructions, I scan them and send them to you, man. I was interested to see how to do the horse. There's like four books. They're not a secret, are they? Slay. No, you can get them on Brickhill. You can get them on Stack Exchange. You can get them on Brickset. You can get them on Bricklink. You can get them. Uh, I looked on Brickset. Brickset couldn't see them on Brickset. Oh, I just I just typed in Lego 428 instructions. Oh, okay. and it came up in Google. But yeah, it shows you like you know you build in three bits. <clears throat> so I have a feeling I'm missing a 
in a bag. Your what? Well, there's no way I am missing. Uh, Have a look. Six. Those corner plates. No way I can be missing six of them. No, you've misplaced them. Have a look under your ass. Why would they be a bag? <laughs> ass. Mm -hmm. Check underneath the bag sixes or nines or whatever they are. Okay, cranky man. Yeah, well, there's no way I can be missing six of these. Anyway. There seems to be a lot for sale on Bricklink for around the 200 mark. Remember how this goes back in? <laughs> Found it. Oh. oh, so it's my fault. Yep. <laughs> Missing bag. You suck. It's all great that she admitted the fault there. What? It's not my fault. We all heard you say it was your fault. I was being anyway. There is a store on Bricklink that have ten of them for two hundred and seventy dollars each. Damn. Yeah, I wouldn't trust that store. There's a store with six of them. Another store with six. What country? Um, dodgy countries. Dodgy countries, of course. Angry. That one, hungry. Because what you'll find is, is the stores that have access to where the factories are. Yeah. You could almost guarantee that somebody just rolled around the factory on the day that they went out. Oh, my God. Offered them all money for it. Yeah. Well, that's like there's a um, store from the Czech Republic, which I think is where it's made, isn't it? Well, that's where one of the factories is, yep. Yeah. They have 50 sets. Yep. So I've, I've heard stories of factory workers that go around the factory when they're released. Yeah. Off the people cash, and it's just before Christmas. Yeah, it's the and same with um, model cars. They sell a lot of the model cars out through the back door. They're effectively genuine, but, you know, the only thing with them is they don't come with certificates of authenticity. Mm. But these ones say they come with the um, greeting card that came with it. Yeah, so they've been they've been bought from factory workers. Yeah. Jeff might have got the greeting card. Jeff might have gotten the greeting card. I didn't. I think the greeting card might have just been for the employees. Yeah. I'm not entirely sure. We got a letter. Yeah, there was definitely a letter for ambassadors. Oh, these back in. Whoops. There you go. Two hundred and fifty-nine dollars from um, Denmark. That would be reliable. You would hope. Um, USA, you'd be paying a million dollars in postage. Oh, there you go. One hundred and eighty-three dollars from Denmark. New sealed. Another store from the Czech Republic that has twelve. Cheers. How many do you need? Eight or is it ten for the the Rangers? Nine. 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 Okay. Eight and one with a red nose. Yes. Shush! Don't tell everyone my plan. <laughs> but yes, there is plans for that. Finish yet, Sean? Finish this much. Awesome. Is that the ground floor? Yep, ground floor. Oh, damn, there's no um, inventory on Bricklink.
But yeah, my plan was to buy the set and then LDD eight more reindeer. That would be cool. Join us. So now that you've put it away, mm -hmm. what is the piece they use for the middle of the antler? The what? what is the the middle of the antler. I thought it was the table piece, but that gets too narrow. Oh, no, it is. It's got a Technic pin on it, doesn't it? You should know these things. I don't know these things. There you go, dark tan. That's what it is, isn't it? The antlers are dark tan? Yeah. Yeah, it came in... Um, some weird looking whatever set that is. Um, actually, two sets. Um, detailing so fiddly. The cursed cobra statue from the. Um, where is it? That quest, whatever it was, theme. Oh, Pharaoh's quest. Pharaoh's quest, yeah. And they go for about five to ten cents each on Bricklink. Sorry. Yeah, I think I'll brickling eight reindeer and then buy the set. Oh, just steal mine. Well, that too. Either way, I need to have Bricklin cake sets. Eight, um, well, I'll probably take photos of the instructions for you. Or you could just bring the instructions over with you and I will keep um, photocopy them. Well, that too. Keep photocopy. Keep photocopy. <laughs> just scan them. Yeah. Yeah, scan yeah. Them. You realise I take my set over there, I'm never seeing it again. <laughs> sure you will. You'll see it next year when you come over for Bricktober. God. You assume that I'm going to come back. Once you've been to Perth once, you won't come back. <laughs> You're assuming that he's going to let you go. I'll be pushing her out the door. <laughs> What are you eating, Steve? Nothing. I can't Nothing. believe you're, you're eating on a live stream, Steve. That is shocking. That. <laughs> what are you eating, Steve? Oh, nice. What are you eating, Ryan? Mm. Uh, I just ate a caramel crown, so, you know, we're all good. Oh, my God, you... You mean you didn't eat a breakaway? No, I told him I was sick of them. And it's disturbing that you realise that I've been eating breakaways, you stalker, you. It's all you ever eat on the streams. 
Oh, from um, where I'm sitting, it sounded right, like right. you said you ate a caramel crayon. I've seen you eat a halal snack pack before. <laughs> or steal from someone's. <laughs> in well, that restaurant. Mm -hmm. That's what happens when you come home with food and don't think of me. <gasps> I think it's funny that they legitimately call them halal snack packs. No, Steve just calls them halal snack packs. Oh, they are halal snack packs. I've seen them on a menu called Halal Snack Pack. I never yeah, have. Of course. I overheard someone ordering a Halal Snack Pack today. Mm-hmm. All I know is in, all, all they are in Queensland is a Snack Pack. No words, just Snack Pack. Ah. Boring. Oh, well. Are we there yet? Well, I'm not sure if Queensland's the most tolerant state anyway. Uh -huh. <laughs> Yeah, the further north you go, the worse it is. Oh, yeah. You have children that sound like they're killing each other. I tune out to it. What are they still even doing awake? Um. Isn't it like 10, 15? Yeah. Do they go to school in the morning? One of them's 14 and the other one's, oh no, 15, sorry. And the other one's five, but the five-year-old had a head injury today. So I don't mind him being up a bit later. So mm -hmm. concussion, whatever, I don't know. I want him to go to sleep though. Yeah, you don't have to keep them awake when they have a concussion or a head injury. That's a bit of a myth. But what you do need to do is you need to be able to rouse them. Yeah. If they're non-rousable, that's an issue. If they're sleeping, they're healing. Well, I better shut him, shut him up and put him to sleep. Any um, any tricks on that one? Um, oh, no. <laughs> I don't know any that uh, aren't going to... Get you in injury. Mm. I'm like any trade secrets because I know I know uh, I do take your advice on on um, on board because I know it's coming from a a um, professional um, perspective. Used to be, <laughs> yeah, but it's you don't lose that knowledge though, do you? So. No, no, you don't. My professional advice, Steve. Stop hitting them over the head with cricket bats. <laughs> <laughs> Is he going to school tomorrow? Uh, unsure. He's got kinder, but I'll see how he is in the morning. With if he's not going to school, then it probably don't matter. Just yeah, I'm I'm probably leaning towards letting him stay home. So you may regret that. Letting him stay home. He has two days off a week already, so the third one's not going to hurt. Needs to be itching to get there on Friday. True. Cat Matches says, just built 40186 sent you a pick seat. Yeah, I'm looking at it. I've, I've sent the, um, the the eyes with the heart. That's the, um, the pig from um, Chinese New Year, I think. It mm. looks really cool. Share the screen so we can all see. <coughs> We're going old school technology with screen sharing. Yeah, Steve's. Is it, yeah. Oh, yeah, that pig. Oh, that pig. Is that the money box one or? No, no. The money box one's red. Yeah. Oh no! Is it the one that came free with whatever? Free with purchase. Well, the Chinese New Year one. Yeah, that'd be the one. Yeah, I think I've got that somewhere. Yeah, I've got that one somewhere. Do you believe I spent way too much money on it? Oh, look at that. Your shared data has exceeded your amount. We're going to charge you extra. Good for you, Optus. Okay. I'll just back charge it to the hotel for having sucky Wi-Fi. Mm. Good luck with that. Well, Optus is, what, it's only, what, $10 for another gig or something when you go over? Yes, but I swear they somehow reduce their gigs. It just seems to be once you've gone over, you seem to use it a lot quicker. 
funny thing that. I still have yet to go over my limit. I've never gone over my limit. I always go over my limit. Yeah, an extra gig for ten dollars. Yeah. And I'll, read the, I'll read the message. You now have an extra gig for ten dollars. Does that make it easier? Hello, Mickey. Yeah, I have 35 gig. I've never used it all. And that's with trying. Yeah, I don't have that much. 50 gig. That's a bit overkill. But do you have 35 gig on your mobile data? Hmm? 35 gig on your mobile? Yes. Yeah, month? Yes. Mm -hmm. How much do you pay for it? That's a difficult question because mine's bundled with my iPad. How much is my actual phone plan? Your phone plan's about 160 a month. Yeah, that's, that's with the iPad. Plan, phone, iPad, and data plans. Yeah. All Apple products. Yes. God, yep. we are getting so ripped off in this country. Um, but, yeah, I have that plan because, like, um, it was all about going and streaming, like, on the road and stuff. And I've used it, like, three times this year. No, tw twice this year. The reason why I'm <laughs> because I stream Spotify 40 hours a week off my mobile data. <gasps> Free Spotify. He's too tight to pay for Spotify. Just use my Spotify account, Sean. You can have multiple um, logins, can't you? Or multiple devices. I don't think so. I'm not too sure what the offer limit is, but yeah, you got to be on a Moth family plan. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. I pay for it, and it's a stupid amount. Just That's like I think I pay for six um, Netflix um, devices. Yeah. You're one person. Yeah, but you know. You can only use them one at a time. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh, it'll be the same plan we're on. Uh, we have a question in the chat. Ken says, ABC question. The key oh, yeah. local and what happens in there? People talk to each other. Um, you can um, use it to post what you're working on or what you're excited about or if you see something really cheap, everyone will love you. Share things that are interesting that are Lego related. If you read the pinned post, it'll tell you everything. You mean there's actually a forum? I think he means Facebook group. Oh, okay. I miss forums. They were so much easier. Yeah, you could have like, you know, threads. Yeah, just because I know Facebook listens to everything. Release Facebook forums. Do you like also love to see that image of the shark stepping on a Lego? <laughs> so please yeah. feel free to post that one. <laughs> that rare image. Yeah. If I see that posted in the next day, I'm going to come and I'm going to slap you, Steve. All the, all the raspberry lolly used as an afro on a. Oh my god, no! Yes, the Riddler afro. I can slap you in person. The other one you need to post yeah, is. Okay. Make sure you post a picture of this oh. part and ask what the part number is. Or tell everyone that Lego Masters applications are open. They're about to be closed, actually. Well, they've been saying that for a month. Oh, look, Ryan, there's enough time you can get your application in. Oh, yeah. Oh, my internet's not working. Oh, damn. You can, you can apply as a solo. They'll allow that. No, my, my internet's not working. I can't can't do it now. Just remember that solo video. It's about Lego. Oh, so I can't use the one I sent you. Then. <laughs> oh, no. oh, the other question to ask as well is where do you buy bulk parts? Uh, press studs. Mm 
What was that little giggle about? Nothing. Press studs. That's exactly what it was about. Press studs. Like Wild Lego press studs. <laughs> Steve. Ryan! What? You did not! <laughs> you did not! Did not what? <laughs> don't make me perma ban you. I don't know whether to laugh or cry because I'm the one that's going to get slapped for it. Oh yeah, I'm going to slap you when I see you at Brick Finch and I'm going to slap Ryan when I see him in Perth. For what? They're posting it. Posting what? It's already been removed, but I've got it on the screen, so. It's on the screen forever. Screenshot. If you do this. But it was worth it. Try posting it on plug and see how that goes down. <laughs> Don't think yeah. I'm in plug. Oh, you'll have to join plug just to post it. You won't be in plug for very long. <laughs> It'll be worth it, Steve. Is that is that my buddy Richie? Yeah, your best friend. He won't remove me. But you know, whenever you mention Richie's Richie's name in in a stream, all of a sudden, hmm? it, it it's kind of like oh, they both get banned. No, nah, Richie's all right. <laughs> Just tag him specifically in it. Oh yes. Uh, Ken says, me wonders when Ryan is going to start singing Baby Shark. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Get out of his head. Firstly, I don't sing. Secondly, I don't sing. But well, if it annoys people, he will sing. Ever since that one time on The Voice. <laughs> baby Shark. Do, 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 do. Baby Shark. Do, 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 do. <sighs> I'm trying to put kids to sleep here. Baby shark, do, 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 baby shark. No, the voice is going to scare them. They'll have nightmares. <laughs> this is like a massive amount of ice cream going in now, so. <laughs> oh, we're not allowed to watch. Steve. Mm. Disappoint. Oh. I'm just you. You're not allowed to turn off the camera while you shove your face full of ice cream. Still got a little bit there. <laughs> That's not ice cream. Oh. You anything about ice cream. Are we there yet? And there it goes. Only. What was passing? What was? Phil, happy birthday for last Friday. I meant to say it. Just remembered. <laughs> <laughs> you have a good day. Cheers, dude. Yeah, yeah. Had had a great day. Awesome. Phil was impressed that we sang happy birthday. Mm. Uh, I even left a comment. Yeah, I saw <laughs> it was funny because, like, it sounded worse when we were actually singing it than when I listened to it on the playback. I'm like, oh, it wasn't nearly as bad as it sounded. Yeah, I remember it being horrible. So. <laughs> The love was there, though. The intent was there. Oh, yes. The, the, the love was there for you, Phil. Mm. So, what did you do for your birthday? Hello? Do you need hearing aids? <laughs> Phil? Spent the, day, spent the day with my family. Oh, that's nice. Did you get Lego? Yeah. What Lego did you get? Uh, a couple of modulars and um, 
uh, and, uh, hospital and a fire, uh, police station and a few other bits and pieces. Nice. Cool. What are you scrabbling through, Dan? Um, I just tiles and Phil might recognise what this is. Yeah, I know what it is. Oh, could, could we be more cryptic? I knew what it was when he started building it. I think you have to twitch. Oh, okay. It's, it's, a, uh, it's a model of a stream deck that uh, one of the guys built. And one of the other guys posted some instructions for it. So. Thought I'd have a go, see if I had enough parts to do it. I'm doing my buttons slightly differently, though. Oh. So, Ryan, how long are you stuck in Adelaide for again? Two long weeks. Two long weeks. Why did you not bring Lego with you, you silly because man? I plan on buying it while I'm here. Oh. Why didn't you buy Lego before you came on my stream? <gasps> because it's not released until tomorrow. Uh, that's no fun. And then I have to drive eight hours to Melbourne to pick it up because Adelaide won't get it. Shame on Adelaide. I'm hoping they will. I'm sure they will. One day. <laughs> One day. It'll be shortly, shortly before Western Australia. It'll be a long time before Western Australia. I, I am fairly certain that I will get back home before the set makes it to the show. That sounds accurate. And after Sunday, I'll have some Lego anyway. Oh, yeah? Yep. I'm picking some up from Kaz. I did Bricklink order from Itty Bitty Bricks for anyone playing at home. Oh, you share a sale on I forgot to check that out. Oh, no. Some not very nice word person for some of the parts I wanted. Wasn't me. No. But I had them in my cart, and then before I could actually go to checkout, someone bought them. All the white um, two by fours. White two by fours. Yeah. Need to know someone who knows someone who can get you like a box of them. <laughs> Two by four plates, not bricks. Ah, oh, plates. Yeah. That's a different thing. Yep. Cool, she says it's 20% off. What do I need? 20% off? Yeah, sand blue hot dogs, sausages. You should have done it Sunday. It was 40% off. Uh, I'm sure if I send a message, nope. I'll get some love. No, I'll I'll pick them up for you, Steve. <laughs> She'll send them. It's okay. No, no, I'll pick them up for you, Steve. Yeah, then he'll have to come see you at Brick Ranch to give you your your order. Nah, Kaz will send them. Should be all right. You, you could just pick them up when you do your little round trip to Adelaide. <laughs> yeah, but that's not for another year or two. No, nah, you're coming up this weekend. No, nah, they'll drag me over next year. No, you're coming this weekend. Yeah. Can't himself this weekend. Not my problem. No, but it's mine if I don't turn up. I'm the one with the keys. That doesn't affect me. It does me, though. Give the keys to somebody else. Brian's got an empty side of the bed for you. That's right. Yeah, that, that's going to stay empty. Sorry. <laughs> oh. Oh, bad face. Oh, well, he'll be all right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. John's right. taking long to build this. So I knew you were biting off too much by saying you'd finish it on one night. Should have done it in three bits. 
really. Mm. Yep, really. So am I the only one that once they open a set has to finish building it? Yep, weirdo. Not in the one day. I can't. I couldn't. Yeah. yeah. I've done it in the past. I've had a couple of sets, two or three sets that I've built over a couple of days. But generally, once I open it, I just sit there and build it. Yeah. I built the seat pad in almost one sitting. Yeah. That took a while. Awesome. 100% of the extra gig that you had has now been used. <laughs> There is no way I've used a gig in the last five minutes. No, they because it's not sent um, immediately, like as to when, when you've used it. Yeah. Oh, these are interesting. Uh, trans purple tile modified one by two diamond with oh, elemental wow. wind pattern. Diamond yeah. element. Jeez, Ryan, do I owe you ten dollars? <laughs> Twenty now. I'll charge, I'll charge the company for it and they'll charge the hotel. I think I'm going to think that you were watching a whole lot of porn, mate. <laughs> ah, mm. This is the shittiest porn you've ever watched. It didn't stop him. He finished. It's a sausage fest. It didn't stop him. He still finished. Oh, yeah, no. And you're obviously not watching the screen I'm watching. <laughs> Why is Emma on the shelf behind you? Is that the Duplo Emmett, Steve? Emmett? Yeah, no, Emmett. No, that's the Brickhead. Oh. That's the Brickhead, Ellen, uh, Emmett. Uh, I see. Not that I was looking at your screen or anything. You can tell someone's going blind when they're... There's a big TV in front of them, but they're still squinting to see it. Fuck. Oh, she's got end games. Don't any of those. No. That looks bored. I'm sorry, Phil. We should be finished by now, but somebody's still building. Don't worry, mate. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. The problem is this. this is yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm just doing the string now. No, keep going. Just hurry up. <laughs> finished yet, Sean? Do you cop this in other places? Just hang on. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, yeah. No, he's much faster in other places. Ow! Oh! It's time management. Good job. <laughs> time management. <laughs> Could be building Lego. Lots of better things you can do. Oh, dear. Yes, honey. <laughs> that alright. Oh dear. Awkward silence. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Always look up those weird things like cloth in the uh, the Bricklink stores just to see if there's anything worth getting. I look at stickers. Oh, yeah, I look at stickers too, yeah. But... And then I look at the price and people want stupid money for stickers. Ryan, is it past your bedtime? It's a school night. Yeah. <coughs> I don't know. I make a joke and nobody hears me. I heard you. I said, yeah. Yeah. It's a school night. 
Well, just because I'm the youngest on the panel. <laughs> Are you? Are you really? I don't know. How old is Dan? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you are the youngest. <laughs> With that haircut, he looks about 15. Youngling. Yeah, what's happened to the beard, actually? He got a nice trimmed beard there. Looks good. I Last do. time I seen you, it was <coughs> all over the shop. Looking a bit scraggly. Yeah. I do like to trim it from time to time, you know. Mm. Maybe no you need to take note, Steve. Sorry? Maybe you need to take note. Mine's not that bad yet. I've got six months' worth of growth right here. <laughs> yeah, I think mine's about four weeks, six weeks, something like that. I had a mate in the army who was like that. <coughs> Couldn't grow to save his life. Mm. Lucky bugger never had to shave on basic training, though, like the rest of us every day. Tap out. It's getting too late for you. For who? Did you have any homework, Ryan? Yeah, he probably did. Did you do your homework, Ryan? <laughs> did you make your lunch for tomorrow? He's gone all quiet. Make he's crying to himself to sleep. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. He's not there. I have dropped out. And he's back. Revolving door. I'm back. Oh, who's this Ryan guy? He's a little brick over man. <laughs> Why does he always leave when I come on? Oh, he's back. What the... I can't believe there's 12 people watching us say nothing. Yeah. Okay. Hi, everyone on the live chat. Yeah, you, missed, you missed all the jokes about have, have you have you done your homework, Ryan? I heard that. And then we spoke about me being the youngest on the stream. And then we spoke about Dan's beard. Well, that's right. Man, I must be getting old. I don't think you're getting old, I think. Oh, that's not very nice, Steve. She's older than I am, so she's old. 
check it out on the stream. If you're older than me, you're old, right? Is that how it works? Sean's old. Sorry? Sean's old. Oh, I'm not. I don't. I think I'm younger than. I think I'm older than Sean. Well, my age starts with the three. Yeah. See, I thought I was. I was. Yeah, you are older than Sean. Yeah, uh -huh. but younger than you. Yes. But I'm younger than. Ah, oh, don't bring poor Phil into it. And I can't remember when Dan's birthday is. He's too wise to comment. <laughs> what up to you, Dan? How old do you think I am? Old enough. You'd be about our age. How yeah. old do I look? Oh no, younger, older. Well, now that you've been, you've you've had the the shearing, you look a lot younger. How old are you, Steve? I have a four and a two, so I'm I could be twenty four, but I'm not. You're certainly not twenty four. No, <laughs> not with an old man with a like that. Four and a two. I'm older than you. You're older than yeah, who? Yeah, Dan's older than me. I know that, but not by much. No, not by much. Just one year. Yeah. One year. So it's a fight out. <laughs> <laughs> Phil's just sitting there quietly. Yeah, but that's, that's not just, fair. Just thinking all these little young spring chickens. Spring chickens. He's only just spring out of the force. So. Come on. So people in the live chat, give us some questions. Awkward silence. Catmatch just says, I'm counting a brick leak order I got today. Mm, question Does everyone actually count everything in their brick leak orders? If I feel no. like. For all those Bricklink sellers out there, 100% I do. <laughs> I I looked, looked, go, yeah, that looks about right. No, if it's a smaller order, I will count. Dark Side Bricks had some parts I was after earlier on, but not quite enough. I was after the um, dice numbers, and you've got some in store. Because I wouldn't have many. No, nah, you didn't. And it was, oh. yeah. I did have a look, and I thought, oh, I want to go there, but... There's not enough stuff I need. No, no, that's all right. I will hit it one day. I'm slowly but surely building up stock. Not looking good here. That's the guy who's actually looking to place a Bricklink order momentarily. Unfortunately, it's going to cost me a couple of hundred dollars, which I'd rather not spend. Anyway, I'm going to have to head off because, you know... Adelaide times a lot more boring than Eastern States times. Dude, you've done you've done well to stay as long as you have. Yeah. Yeah, especially on a school night. <laughs> With a snapper. It was a that or running regulations. So. Well, thanks for dropping in. Appreciate it. That's all right. Have fun. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Hurry up and finish, Sean. Get out there. Bye. See ya. Bye. See you, Ryan. Don't have too much fun. Well, he'll have all the fun without us. <laughs> feel the love, Steve. Feel the love. Oh, I feel it. It hurts. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. <laughs> Yeah, dark side. At midnight. Yeah, mate. Nice. Oh, hang on. Show that again, Dan. That's cool, dude. Cool. That is cool. You probably won't understand what it is until I hold up an actual one beside it. So. You stream decks. Wow, it looks almost identical. Yeah. I thought, it was, I thought it was just like a phone with all the apps. It yeah. pretty much is. Yeah. It's pretty cool.
Yeah. It's just like a, it's a little macros keyboard that you use to switch all your scenes and stuff. Mm -hmm. So real one. Oh, wrong way. Lego one. Cool. Nice. Great. Bye, Ryan. Done. The way thing. Can we put this over? Almost makes you want to get one. Put it out. Mm. For it. Got some very nice pieces. Okay. Very nice. I like how the bay windows, mate. Yeah. These ones are cooler. Mm. That's yeah, that's what I was saying. The bay window. Okay. If you not know what a bay window is. I can't believe I'm going to attempt to mock a modular on Thursday. I must be mad. Are you mocking on Thursday? I'm mocking a modular fire station. Whoa. Yeah, I must be off my tree. That's a good talent. Yeah, not for that, but we'll see what happens. Unfortunately, I'm missing 36 1x6 white bricks and 50, 57 2x4 dark red bricks. But I'm hoping I can build up until that point, and that should keep me busy in a string. Because even if I could order them, I don't think they're going to be here by then. Mm. By, by Thursday night. Oh, it depends. If I get them from Queensland Bricks, they probably will be, but I'll have to pay for it. No idea. Uh, Sorry? So close now. I can smell it. Yeah, if you got it from Queensland Bricks, you'd have to pay for Overnight Express. Oh, no, I don't just mean that. I mean the actual price. Oh, yeah. But I've brought exclusively from her in the past, and she's not that bad. She's a really nice person to, to deal with, too. Mm -hmm. I just wish I had more um, normal bricks on the pad wall when I was there. Oh, really? Yeah, there wasn't enough normal stuff in the colours that I wanted, like two by four whites and white whites and those sort of, those sort of things. They had all the the pretty colours, but none of the none of the real colours. I had lots of friends' colours, put it that way. Mm. I think I'm going to replace all the 1x6s and 1x4s with masonry bricks. I'm going to have the weakest building. It won't be able to be moved. If I move, it'll fall apart. How does it? Sh where does it show you how many orders you've had in the store? On Bricklink, do you guys know? Um, I see it when I leave feedback for people after they've um, paid for their orders. It tells me how many orders they've had. Oh, okay. Um, if you open up one of your invoices, one of your old sales, click on the order number, yeah. and yeah. up top it says how many orders you've had in the store. Mm. I think it might be one of the last things that it says. That's cool. I was hoping it might be on the page, but that's all right. Uh, under summary, I think. Hang on for a second. Pick a name. Um, oh, she won't mind if I use hers. Okay, hang on. Where is she? That's right. We have two more freaking bags. Yeah, it's for the roof. Here you go, dude. You're looking... 
do this. Um, I should be able to do it this way, actually. Uh, give me two seconds. That's right. If this works. Okay, that's working, but is it going to work? I'll have to change to that screen there. Uh, bink. Hang on, just jump out of my room, jump into my toy folder. <laughs> okay. Da -da -da. Ah, green screen. Don't need to see that. Okay. <laughs> and I know this person won't mind me showing stuff. This customer, you can see right there, the very last thing. It says how many store orders in this store. Yeah. So if you just go to a stand, go to any of your orders. Yeah. It should actually show up there. And if Amy accidentally is, happens to be watching this stream, I'm sorry. <laughs> but she's pretty cool. She wouldn't mind me doing that. There was no personal info there, so. No. Thanks, man. I'll see if I can. That's right. That's nice. I haven't been active enough on Bricklink this year. Go back into my room now. And yes, this is all my actual stuff that's behind me in this picture. Damn. Last yeah. bags. What was I doing? Oh, that's right. Spending too much money. I can't believe I just sold off all my stair, um, my seven by six, seven by four by six straight staircases. I just sold the last one, and I, now I need to buy two. <laughs> <laughs> Always the way, isn't it? Yep. Don't even your yawning. So stop and making this a one night thing. Not a one night, it's two. Yeah, the first night you did bugger all. Yeah, because you wanted a short stream. Mummy and daddy are fighting again. This is about as heated as, as our arguments get. Yeah. Thanks. Ah, uh, two. They're dark blue grey. I can't replace those. Damn it, I need those 19. That's going to be the pain in the butt to get. Six, um, one by six by five black girders. They're going to hurt. That should do me for now. All right, bring on. Oh, look at that. Queensland Bricks is the top choice. Okay, fine. Oh, that's not too bad. What's missing? Only 44. I guess can't be choosers. Oh, she's got all three of those. She's being sorely tempted. Okay, you know what? Go back. Because I've been placed. I don't need the door. I've got the one by two tiles. I already delete those. I already delete those. Oh, don't need those. I need these brown ones. Mm, Cat Man just says Ali Big Bloke is a quick builder. <laughs> About half an hour ago. Did you retract your, your message, Cat? What happened? Oh, well, say I'm awake, but I'm not. This was definitely a three night job. Yeah. 512 1 by 4 red and brown. First night. 
Someone's doing sleepers for a train track. Mm. What the hell are these doing in this? Do I have a need for those? At the longest two and a half. Did Queensland bricks used to be called something else? Yeah, um, um, Q bricks. Ah, uh, that's why I couldn't find. 18 orders in that store. <laughs> wow. Most recent was last year, August 8th. Oh, did you find an old? Oh, in summary. Because I was looking for Queensland. I, I know I've used... Um, yeah, it used to be Jay's Bricks or something, I think. It might have been Jay's Brick Store or something. Yeah. What's that? Q Bricks. Yeah. Jeez, I've had a few orders. <laughs> 6,076 orders she's done. I've never sold anything, but um, 49 orders on the for TLC Bricks. 38 for itty bitty bricks. So, Kaz. Um, there's now, a where is one in that? Got me oh, under yeah. summary. My order's placed. Oh, okay. Hang on. Orders. There you go. Yeah, I've done 20 orders with Queensland bricks, 12 with Ali's, 11 or Ali's, whatever, it's, whatever it is. Uh, 11 with Haytan, 9 with Max Space, and then it goes down from there. I've got 11 with Haytan as well. Uh, Max Space. No. With Haytan, not yet. I'm wanting to, but... Not for the one of trying. But I'm sure I've got... I've Haytan, between Haytan and Queensland Bricks, they built my Star Wars table. I've got eight pages. Oh, I've only got four pages or lot, but I sell more than I buy. No, that's not true. <laughs> you like to think you sell more than you buy. No, no, I don't. As on your little shop. Okay, let's have a look. Yeah, it's handy with Justin being five minutes away now. That 49 will only increase. Okay. I have to see if there are any coupons I have. Oh, look. What has she got? What can I afford not to buy? Wow. If I buy everything I need all from Queensland Bricks in one hit, it's going to cost me 204 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is a module. Mm, yeah. Good point. Are you done yet? Just about. Where's the last one? Oh, Cat Manifest, it's all those names sound familiar, Sellers and me as the buyer. Yeah, they're all pretty reputable, well known stores. Ow, 77 of those. Except for TLC Bricks, he's really dodgy. Ow! That awkward moment when you see you've got an open coupon and you realise it's a place in Germany. Yeah. Still going to check it out. I'm going to try and be smart about this, which doesn't usually work for me, but I'm going to try anyway. Holy crap. Dark red brick, one by ten, five dollars ninety each. Jesus. Just Glad I Steve. I only need two, but I mm, think I might give those a miss. Remove those from the order. That's a bit better. Dark blue grey, same size, 58 cents each. Damn you, dark red. What do I have to go with a dark red building? Legend, mate, because you're crazy. Yeah, I never pick the easy colours. Well, my modular fire, my police station is going to be white, so that should help. I said should. <laughs> 
20 of those at 35 cents each. I can live with that. 19 of those at 32. Okay, look, great, right, remove that. Can remove light blue gray, so I can remove. Cut down on the red. Why is that costing so much? Can't cut down on the white. Forty four of those at thirty two cents each. Bloody hell. Well, that's only 12 bucks. Where's all this? My brain's not working. I can't understand why this is adding up so, to so much. Obviously, I'm missing something. Oh, that could have something to do with it. Jeebus! 22 garage door roller sections, trans clear for a dollar five each. Remove. That would do it. <laughs> oh, look at that. Total just plummeted through the floor. Next. <laughs> Jesus. These plants are pretty. Yeah. What's the good thing about those leaves is that you can actually put the friends. Um, the, the clickets um, flowers in with the pins because it has a hole for pins. Aha! Uh -huh. Here's another eight dollars worth of plates. Um, Have you got uh, your heart set on uh, trans clear or would you use trans light blue? I'm using trans light blue. I'm using the ones from the current fire station that I've got that I've pulled apart. And I'm going to use the ones from the police station. How many do you need? Oh, God. Uh, 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 yeah, about that many. <laughs> Couldn't tell you off the top of my head, dude. Um, hang on. 20 something, because that's what you just took out of your car. 22, yeah. But that might have only been all they had. You might have needed more than that. Yeah, I'm just going to scroll through and check. Pretty sure I've got. A heap of trans light blue I can help you out with because I'm pretty sure I bought them in a lug bulk one year. Oh, well. yeah, 22. But that'd be minus whatever comes with the original the fire station that I've got at the moment. No, right. which you uh, know, I'm sure I've got paid for. I'll, I'll let you know because I've removed them from that order. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's the 4x8, 6x10, 6x10, 6x12 plates that are going to cost me a small fortune. Why well, are plates worth a dollar something each? God damn it. They probably don't come in very much. Yeah, 6x10 six by, six by light blue grey. Hang on, I'll just go in my room and tear apart any Star Wars set that I've got and I'll have, I'll have the eight that I need. I reckon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not they're not exactly rare right i might bounce it's uh just after one yeah i'm surprised you fell in that long heck i'm barely holding in are you going to finish soon or are you going to be a while this is it god and what's down here he's so stubborn i'm not doing two bags next week committed yeah, you should have stopped. Stop yeah, he should be. So. <laughs> stop going to build that Sorry. <laughs> yeah, that would have been it's good. the right thing to say at the right It time. sounded perfect. <laughs> Don't mind us. We're just having our own conversation. I completely missed all of it. Yeah. Oh, 33 cents to get one of those. Great oogly mooglies. Oogly mooglies? 43 cents each, and I need 24 of them. Dingly danglies? One by eight 
light blue gray tiles. Oh, remove. It's going to come back and bite me. I'm sure they're going to be important. Yeah, totally. All right, I'm going to bail. Sorry, guys, I can't hang in there. No, no, no. I appreciate you being here. I wasn't expecting this to be like a four-hour stream. I'm sorry. All good. Jesus, I've got to go in six minutes and get Mel from work. I forgot she started work today. She said, last thing she said was you got out of guard. Don't forget me. It's like, yeah, yeah, whatever. Oh, you. Oops. Right. Talk to you all don't next time. Don't, don't, don't. Bye. Bye, Dan. Have a good one, Bye, man. Buddy. Bye, Dan. See you, bud. Catch up. Oh, 12. 12 of those at 75 cents each for a 2 by 4 dark red tile. Remove. Oh, making the total plummet here at the moment. There's another eight dollars, but I need all eight of those window frames because I don't have any. Damn it! Oh, I think I'm actually. It's like a beard stroking moment. Mm. Oh, yeah. Taffy's still in the chat. She's still in the chat. Sound off, say hi. Fun, hey, you still there? God, Blockade UK still hanging in. Andrew Thornton still there. Good. Wow. Martin in. Says, see you, Dan. Ken's still here. Kat's, Kat yeah. sent me um, like a screenshot of her orders. Yeah. Her Bricklink orders. And hopefully she won't mind this one, but 58 orders to Aussie Brickster. And I know why that's so high. It's because she has the ability to pick them up. So... Yeah. <laughs> I would do it too if he lived that close. Yeah, I've got more than a few orders from Aussie Brickster, and yeah, he looks after me when I leave things to the last minute. Yeah, no, he always okay. good, uh, always good parts. Really nice guy, Paco. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's like a two hour drive so, or hour and a half for me to get to his place, and I've been there once before, but oh, it's it's crazy. So if ever I purchase from Paco, I have to get it um, sent. So that makes it harder too. If he has parts that I can get from somewhere else um, that I can pick up from, that's where the way I'd go. Uh -huh. Wow. Uh, now it's time to eat lunch in the UK. Just gone 2 p.m. Wow, that's a late lunch. I must admit, this corner garage does look very pretty. If I'd been paying attention, I'd probably also be saying, oh, it has lots of lovely techniques. Just more focused on getting it finished. Yep. Finish. That awkward silence when everyone's looking on on uh, Bricklink. Okay. <laughs> Love looking up the minifigure utensils um, decorated. There's always something cool in there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my 
Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Killed the one I wanted to finish it. Yeah, well, I wasn't going to do like a one hour stream next week. I feel like I should be sing you know, like playing music or something. Elevator music. Do, 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 do. No, that doesn't help at all. Shark, baby, shark. Do, 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 do. That definitely doesn't help. <laughs> Might speed him up because he doesn't want to hear it. Speed me up because I don't want to hear it. <laughs> I'll just tune it out. Phil's like, I'm out of here. You're taking so long, Phil will be leaving us. I actually do have to. Actually, I have to go. It's eleven fifteen. No. Okay, I'm out. Hopefully, hey, man. be here when you get back. He won't be. I have. <laughs> I doubt it. Left. Yeah, famous. Mel, Mel's first first night back after three weeks off. There's no way she's getting out on time. Yeah. All right. Bye, all. See you, Phil. Now we're down to flipping between two screens. Please don't leave, Steve. I've got nowhere to be. Don't leave. I feel like I've, I missed a big chunk in the middle anyway, so. You did miss a big chunk in the middle. Was it good? I don't know. I meant to say yes, so I'd go back and watch it. It's all a bit of a blur, really. Uh. Well, it was the part where Ryan declared his love for you, but, you know. <laughs> now, Ken says to light up all his modulars is going to cost him over a grand. Not if you do it right. Ah, Ken Wheels is trying to find out how to do a bulk order for on Bricklink without having to come from multiple people. Um, when you're looking up the part number you need to go, there's like a, an option for, um, what is it, the highest quantity. You need to click on that and find the stores that have the highest quantities of the piece that you're after. Yeah, if you do a want, wanted items list, I think. I don't think what he's looking for is overly uncommon. Mm. Well, take it that you're a little... Yeah, uh, a little new to Brickling, perhaps, Ken? Maybe? Oh, we all are. <laughs> Just the depth of fairies? We'd like to think that. <laughs> if I go to... New profile. It is almost 10 years since I first... Place to Bricklink order. Oh my god! October 10, two thousand and nine. Was I've been a member since? Okay, it's almost ten years since we moved to the Sunshine Coast from Gimpy. And you know how you get, you don't always get feedback for your purchase. Mm. My feedback is six hundred and sixty-one. Wow. Orders. Now, Andrew Thornton says, I'm very new to Bricklink. I um, made a total of three orders. Well, we all got to start somewhere. So I don't want to think about how many orders I've made on Bricklink. Okay, it's that many. Yeah. 
correct, yeah? Yeah. Wow, not that I'm after it, but monorail track. Finished. Put together the mini fixes, slacker. That's more a, a Cherie job, isn't it? Well, he didn't hand them to me, so how am I supposed to do them? Hey, so I'm not getting involved. To me now. Are you finished your job? Sounds like he's done more than finished the job. <laughs> mm. Ken Wheel says, no, I've, oh, what? I've, no one I've found has the amount I'm looking for. Are you looking for the right kind? Because in a lot of cases with tiles, there's ones with grooves and ones without grooves. Maybe look at the alternate. You may be looking at the wrong particular one. Yeah. Sure. Oh, we have Pops Block Shop. Three years on Bricklink, finally having more sales than I ordered. Almost 1,300 sales to 1,200 orders. Well, congratulations on that. And that's yeah. just trading bricks. That's actually quite quite something to go by. Yeah. Um, Blockhead UK, I'm guilty of saying monorail. I'm not into monorail because I don't have any of it. But um, the store I'm looking at has a section for monorail with $28. It's it's probably better for you, Euro in uh, for the UK. 17.7563 Euro per piece. So that equates to $28 Australian. I'm not getting into monorail. It's too expensive. <laughs> We have one completed modular. Nice. I've got I've got this one to build as well, but it's going to take a while for me to get to that one. So yeah, mm. last week I only built like bottom level minus this part. Mm. Yeah. Right, I built this part, this level, this level, and this level. So what do you think? It's cool. Yeah. Well, he thinks it's cool. He built it. Oh, yeah, I know, but comparing it to, um, say, uh, assembly square is unfair because of the size of it, but well, maybe maybe the diner. How would you compare it to the diner? doesn't have the visual striking sort of um, with the colours, does it? No, the diner really does pop, but this is more of an industrial building, whereas the other one's more hospitality. Yeah. You want the diner to pop out because you want people to go in and visit. Oh, absolutely. It's the aesthetics of that one. But does this one have more playability, do you think? Having the garage, though? Probably about the same. Yeah, because you've got the garage and the tow truck. You can... Can you access the Can you access the garage from the front as well, not just the side? Mm, no. No. Okay. It's just for looking pretty. Yeah. But it is sort of the standard, Um. yeah, create to sh display sort of more than play. Pretty much. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Flow feature is more just popping a little. Yeah. And playing within the levels. Yeah. But that's oh. most modulars, really. It's, yeah, not... it's interesting being a corner block, like mm. a corner. Hmm. It's the techniques that they've done to get in these sort of windows. I feel like because you've rushed it, you've not shared the details as you've gone. But never mind. So, looks good. corner garage. No, it looks good. I think you guys should uh, press the red button and <laughs> get offline. Yeah, thanks Honestly. for coming, Steve. Oh, no, that's, uh, yeah, sorry I couldn't be there the whole time. Just, yeah. Uh, that's okay. We understand. Anyway, on that note, I uh, probably should say thank you to everyone who has uh, stuck with us through this four-hour freaking bloody long marathon of a stream looking at you and thanks for all your questions and uh keeping me company while he builds yeah yeah <laughs> all right on that note i want to say uh thank you to everyone who's joined me on the panel tonight dan phil um well steve ryan. already said yeah uh ryan yeah. for um <laughs> I'm for chewing through his internet. Oh, yeah. I feel so bad. I really do. 
I swear I don't use that much data when, when I'm streaming um, away from home. Um, maybe Optus is a bit mean when it comes to extra gigs. I don't know. It's anyway, just South Australia. I know he's not a he's not a local. No. They pick on him. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, now we've got to figure out where the heck we're going to fit this in the house. Mm -hmm. Yay. All right. Red button time, boys and girls. See you Good on night. Friday. Good night, Harry. Boop. Boop. Ugh. <laughs>